Hello? Hello. Hi. Hi, what's up? What's Ricky gonna do now? He needs his hit. Well, they they changed his name, so I mean it's not even Ricky anymore. It's Sha Shaquille O'Deal. Um, are we good? Hey, listen, today's a weird day. Um, I have to leave here at two. Uh, so we got a couple hours to play oxygen, not included. I gotta leave at two. I gotta do a thing. I gotta go pick up my kids. I got some other stuff that I need to do after I've picked up my kids. Um, and then we'll be back at uh, at five o'clock BST. For um, for Minecraft, the Minecraft uh, Minecraft uh, showdown, um, we we've had some news about our team. CPK is uh, unavailable today, and is being uh, replaced by somebody else. Uh, like two, two, two junk, two two four two something. So hopefully he's a, a valid replacement because CPK was uh, kind of a beast. Um, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes. It is it, it is the Euros, yeah. It's the European final <laughs> to, today. Um, it's not Tupac, no, sadly. Um, so that's at five o'clock tonight. We'll start at five. So I'll start streaming. We got to check in and stuff, and then um, we'll join and uh, see how we do. Yeah. It's uh, it should be. I don't know. I don't think we're going to do very well, but pff, I didn't think we would do well in the first uh, thing, and we made it through the finals, so we'll see. Am I going to play Chivalry 2 anytime soon? Is it out yet? If it's out, I'll play it, yeah. Will I stream the finals? Um, depends on how hungry I am. I don't know. Make sure you eat beforehand. Yeah, I will. So I, so I'll, I won't be online from 2 until 5, and then I'll be back at 5. Because, like I said, I have a bunch of crap that I need to do. Um, it's just a, it's just a weird day. I have like a meeting and some other, um, some other crap. Um, I have a meeting for something that I'm potentially doing at the end of the month, which is probably going to be pretty different. But I don't know. It'll be. I, I'm, I think it'll be a bit funny. Like the, the context of the whole thing is actually kind of funny. But we'll see. It, it could just be really shit. <laughs> I mean, I'm getting paid for it, so it's pretty good. Oh, Chivalry 2 comes out later today. All right, okay, good. Um, anyway, well, well, let's play some Oxygen Not Included. It's been a while. Spaced out, the uh, the DLC is out. There's lots of changes. There's nuclear jet, There's nuclear uh, power in it. There's radiation. There's all sorts of new fun stuff. There's more emphasis on uh, space travel in this one. Uh, and lots of like smaller planets that you can go to and mine and do stuff. Um, We'll try it out. Let's try it out and see see how it goes. It's a fun game. We've we've played hundreds of hours of it in the past, um, so it, it it should be a good one to get stuck into. Yes, oxygen not included, spaced out. Yeah, we can build all sorts of fun machines. We'll do some ranching this time. Let's see if we can get some some good ranching online. We'll do some recycling of materials and shit like that. It's gonna be great. Uh, let's do a new game. And um, we'll do survival. And uh, we could do classic scenarios similar to the classic oxygen not included experience. Large starting asteroids with many resources, less emphasis on space travel. Or we can go scenarios designed for the spaced out DLC. Smaller starting asteroids with resources distributed across the star map. More emphasis on space travel. So I think your, your starting uh, place is smaller than you would be used to and limited. And, uh, and and it, it, th there's emphasis on you uh, traveling to other planets and uh, finding resources and having some sort of distribution system back and forth and stuff like that. Yeah? I don't know which one you guys prefer. I kind of prefer the uh, the classic, but we can try spaced out and see, see what it's like. A whole planet of piss. The, pen the, the planet of the piss planet. Try it. Classic. Spaced out because you want to see the spaceships. A big distribution network sounds sexy. There's a lot of people saying classic. Is classic the way to go here, do you think? Whatever sounds fun to you. 95% say classic. All right, spaced out it is. <laughs> um, I mean, I feel like we should try the new, the new uh, type. But maybe we can start. Okay, let's start with classic then. We'll start with classic, and then we can, um, and then we can build our way up to to space travel. Yeah, the new mode is quite difficult. All right. Okay. 
classic then. I don't I don't need more difficulty. Um, location details. You don't get to change. It's a large Terra cluster. Um, a promising location with a balanced variety of resources. Terra meets all the requirements for duplicate life and holds no surprises. It's an ideal location for first attempt at establishing a colony. Um, there's a radioactive uh, swamp asteroid nearby. A tundra asteroid, a marshy asteroid, a superconductive asteroid, a mu asteroid, and a water asteroid. Survival chance is ideal. Okay, start game. A Mu asteroid. A big piss pit. Yeah, I guess we'll have a big piss pit, right? You're playing this game currently? It's so cute. It's a great one. It's one of the best. Honestly, it's a great game. You've had radioactive swamp ass before? Mm, me too. I chose classic 9 9. I chose the classic. I thought we left the moo behind in weed shop. No, no, we're, we're coming back to it. Um, okay, we have um, we have Jean, Frankie, and Harold. Um, Jean is good at, uh, is interested in cooking, tidying, and decorating, and has plus one cuisine, plus three strength, and plus one creativity. Um, decreased cuisine as a cook, and increased food morale bonus. These are the, uh, this is Kitchen Menace. So, cuisine plus one and then cuisine minus three. I don't know how you guys feel about this. I kind of like to just, like, go with what I'm given. Because I think it just mixes things up a bit. Rather than re-rolling, re-rolling, re-rolling and trying to get, like, the ideal candidate. I, I like to just sort of deal with what I'm given. And then, you know, as the dupe printing comes online, then you sort of pick the ones that you want. Um, Frankie is pretty bad though, yeah. He's interested in wearing a suit, he has pl plus 7 athletics. His, he's skilled in super duper hard digging, uh, which he starts with a tier 3 skill for, that's not bad. But, he has a decrease uh, in calories, minus 500 calories per, per cycle, he's got a bottomless stomach. And, loud sleeper for Harold with uh, plus 8 piloting, I don't want a loud sleeper on the colony, yeah. I don't want to, I don't want to bring Harold I will reroll. Okay, we got plus 2 machinery, plus 2 medicine, plus 1 creativity, interested in operating, doctoring and decorating, increased uh, germ resistance, uh, but decreased agriculture. I mean, that's fine. Lyra is fine, I think. Um none none of these conflict with uh, her plant murderer um trait. <laughs> it's a plant murderer. Um, and we could probably reroll uh, Frankie as well because uh, the decreased uh, calories is no good. Uh, let's just reroll all of them. Let's see what we get. Uh, plus two science, interested in researching, plus one agriculture, and plus two piloting, farming rocketry, decreased medicine. Okay, we'll keep her. And then uh, this guy is building plus four construction, plus four science, uh, but decreased in agriculture. We do have somebody who is interested in farming and agriculture here And this guy could be he's interested in researching and has plus four science so he can be our uh, science person So we're just looking for somebody who's better at digging uh, we'll, we'll we'll grab somebody from the uh, from the printer who can do digging, right? I think that'd be fine. What do we want to call the colony? The inspiring space camp Oh, do you guys want to, do you want me to name any of these? Does anybody want to be in this? We can if you want, I don't mind. Me. Yes, me. Panda bear. Panda, panda, panda bear? I, I think I spelt it right, I don't know. Kenny, 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 Nyan, Nyan Kenny Nyan Cat? And um, who else is around? Rob XD. Rob XD is here as well. Okay, we're gonna call this. Um, um, we're gonna call this one uh, Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds a va vacation s station. Okay, let's embark. We're going. We're going like this. I know it's not ideal, but whatever. It's fine. Yeah. 
Can you name it, rename it to be correct? I can't. I see uh, I see like lots of ends in your name and I just my brain shuts down. So I'm sorry. I've done my best. I've done my best. That's all the that's all the time I can uh, I can give to to it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. I would like in please. Okay. Don't worry. We'll we'll get we'll get you guys in as we print more duplicates. We're not going to have like that many, but um okay, we can start let's start like uh digging. Uh, immediately and let's start pooling some of this water together too right I think we can start pooling it in here and then uh, and then move so shift some of this down into here we'll make a big water tank that we can use for doing science and shit like that and we'll have to make some beds and some toilets and all that kind of crap too um, so let's do it we'll start uh, let's start digging out to the side here all the way over to this um, crappy biome and let's start digging out to the side more or less like here I guess too and um, we can also do like some platform stuff too right we'll speed up the game too close all these tutorials we don't need these I'll be honest the thing preventing this game from being perfect is that it doesn't have power washing true yeah I mean it could do with some power washing that would be good um, our priorities and stuff are fine for now until we actually start getting some jobs and stuff set up. Hey, Racket22, thanks for the 420. Name the worst one after me, smile. Okay, it's too late, but I'll bear it in mind, okay? I'll bear it in mind. What's power washing? You don't know what power washing is? That's wild. In this day and age, you don't even know what a... You don't even... You can't even appreciate a good... A good pee wash? That's, that's nuts. Okay, um, whoops. We're gonna go, like, down here. And we'll do the old, uh, we'll do this one. Where you leave, like, one, two, three, four gaps. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we need one here and here as well. So let's get rid of that. And, uh, and then the idea is that you dig all this out, right? And you get some nice, um, the gases flow better, right? So the oxygen and everything that you need will flow around nicely. And then we can just, we're, we'll want to just dig out like four tall platforms all the way down. Like so. And like so. And then over here too. This should be four. That's good. We'll have to put like a ladder here so that we can get into all this stuff. That's fine though. And then we can dig this one out all the way to here. Actually, probably further. We're going to have some polluted water and crap to get from here. It looks like there's a little office that we can explore. And we're looking, of course, always for uh, vents and stuff. We want to see what's here. And then we're going to start making, like, a water tank here. I like this game, but probably too dumb to play it myself. Simon Powell? No, I think you'd be good at a game like this, honestly. I think you'd be fine. And then we also want to build the ladder uh, up here too, right? So we'd have like this. One, two, three, four. Like that, right? And then we can keep digging all this crap out too. We just want to have some space to make things, right? We want to make like, uh, for example, furniture. Let's get some cots set up. Let's get like four cots set up in here. And then we'll get a bathroom set up, too. I've read all the wikis for this game. I Honestly, I haven't. It's been a long time since I played it, and uh, some stuff I remember, but I'm in the mood to just dick around with stuff. I don't know if you ever get like that. Like, I've been playing in the evenings, and, like, all I've been doing is just, like, farting around with ranching. I kind of like the whole loop of um, feeding, uh, like, critters stuff that is useless and then turning it into useful stuff. So, I don't know. We'll try some ranching or something. Like, we'll, we'll just see. I have every wiki open, yeah. Ranching is fun. Yeah, I don't know, like, what's ideal and stuff. But, like, I would love to try doing some, like, big nuclear stuff and whatever. I think that'd be really fun. There's a very nice pool of clean water I have there. Would be a shame if someone pissed in it. I know. We we're, we'll try to avoid people pissing in the water. It's uh in a lot of ways though it is unavoidable, right? It's just this game. 
you're not playing oxygen included if if somebody hasn't pissed in your in your water in your water tank. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Exactly. Exactly. If I catch anybody pissing in the water, it's game over, man. It's, it's freaking game over. That that I will not stand for. Um, okay, so we're going to make the tank a little bit lower just so that it can line up with uh, the rest. So this is like one, two, three, four. Um, and then this will be like a thing here. So we would normally have uh, that branch off so let's make we'll make the tank like quite big i think we'll have it like I mean, there's like quite a bit of water here well there's not that much water actually we'll make it quite big and then we'll make it how much across do you think like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten across twenty across Okay, let's go 20 across. I think that'll be fine, right? So this is going to be a water tank in here. Um, and then we'll clear all this out. We'll combine this into here. We're going to need ladders, like, all the way down. We've got a lot of building projects already. And then we'll get, like, some mesh at the top. And then we'll hope that nobody pisses in the water. That's huge. Yeah, it's pretty big. But, I mean, we got it. We, we'll have the combine these three pools combined into here, right? And then there might be some more water. I mean, we could, uh, we could, um, turn this polluted water into normal water, or maybe just use that for, like, the bathrooms and stuff. Speaking of bathrooms, um, what's the priority thing? Priority. We want to make this, like, a priority six. Let's get this cleared out here. This will be our bathroom. See, somebody's already pissing, but luckily not into the fresh water, right? Somebody's already done a huge piss here. Somebody's trapped as well. What the hell? How have you managed this? Oh, okay, it's fine. I should have built the toilets first. We've already had a pisser. Two pissers. We're going to have to get this all tidied up. Gross. Gross. That's disgusting. It's so realistic, I know. It's not safe. Okay, we'll have to close this. Let's go for uh, doors. We'll do like the double door so that the so that the um, stuff can can go through, and we'll go for um, is it plumbing? Outhouses, yeah. Let's get a couple of outhouses and sinks too, right? Sinks comes under medicine, wash basin. Let's get this stuff built as priority. We want to get these bathrooms up and running before bedtime tonight. And we want the beds all built before bedtime tonight, too. So we'll do some priority on these beds as well, right? If it lets me. And then we want to mop up all of this pee. All this pee-pee. Uh, let's put that like that. That like that. So anybody coming out of here has to wash their hands once we fill it. We're going to need to get uh, access to water, which we'll have pretty soon. And we'll do the pump as well. So we'll have a pump. We can do like a two-stage pump. Have you ever seen a two-stage pump? So you have like a pump at this level and then a pump at this level. And because you have like a, a separation of four, the root thing from the pump goes down four. So that if the tank is low, you take from the lower pump. But then if the tank is, is like almost full, you take from the top pump. It's like a like a... You've only seen zero stage pumps. Well, you've come to the right place. You're going to love this. You're going to love what I do with the pump. Yeah. You're going to love it. Just wait till you see what you do with the pump here. It's incredible. It's a wiki level play. That's right. I love pumping. You're a one pump and done kind of guy. One singular pump is not enough for me. I, I like to get in there. I like to get in there and get nasty. You know? Ever get nasty? Have you ever gotten, like, super nasty before? Um, plumbing, we want to get a pitcher pump. Um, we can't rotate it, so we're just going to have to go like that, I guess. And then we'll have another one down here, but, like, over to the side here. So we'll have, like, ladder, right? And then we'll have 
another pitcher pump like that so that'll cover all the way to the bottom and this will cover all the way down here yes and then we'll also have um some tile like say here for example with more ladder and then in here we're gonna have a bottle emptier okay and more ladder all the way across and then we'll replace this ladder with mesh flooring look everybody's having a nice sleep in their own bed they can't sleep because this stupid light is flying around and keeping them all awake we're gonna have some tired panda bear and kenny and nyan cat especially they're gonna be very tired there's a stupid uh like a glowing bug preventing them from sleeping Can close all these. Let's close all these down. Where are the rifles when you need them? Exactly. Exactly. I, I, the answer is I don't know. I don't know where they are. Okay, so once we um, start accessing some water and then uh, consolidating all of this water, then we can start getting our science stuff set up. Yes? Science would be nice. Um, let's get some priority on all this stuff. This is this is the task at hand here. We want to get all this crap built. Which means we want all this crap built as well. And most of this crap too. So that'll be the priority. To start working on this water tank. How big is the world? I think on Classic it's, it's quite big. There's something over here. And over here too. It looks like there's some... Some fart bubbles. Um, but yeah, I think because it's because we're playing on classic. It's quite big It's gonna leak. No, it's not gonna leak. Don't worry. We're not gonna have any leakage uh, We might have some leakage over here actually But hopefully they'll have dug out a lot of this before that happens, right? Let's get this all dug out for example We're gonna want all this dug out With a higher priority as well we're going to put all of this stuff on a priority 7, okay? So this is like priority 7 stuff, this side, and then we go to the to the 6 stuff after. Yeah? There we are. Um, wait, though, we can't do this stuff here because of the sand, right? So we'll put that on a priority 5 for now. No, no, there's not going to be any leakage. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. It's quite, it's quite a big thing to start working on straight away. You know? It's quite a big thing. We've got to make sure that this is built first. Let's get rid of this stuff too. See, if we get this wall built first, we're laughing all the way to the bank. There you go. That's the one. Is there any new updates in um, Auction Not Included in the last few months? Yeah, there's a whole DLC, uh, which we're playing uh, right now. It's a whole new DLC with tons of new features. Okay, let's see who we get. We have a snazzy suit that we can take if these guys suck. We got a guy who is interested in operating and has plus 12 in machinery, but he has irritable bowel and a bottomless stomach. Uh, we also have somebody who's into rocketry, supplying, and suit wearing. Um, is uncultured, a quick learner, and a gourmet, but uh, is squeamish. Um, should we just take the suit for now? Not a great combo, no. We're going to take the suit for now, okay? We're going to take this suit and we're going to give it to somebody. We're going to give it to... Who do you think is the best? Rob XD. There you go. Rob XD is going to wear a snazzy suit. There you go. There you go, Rob XD. You got it. You got it. Don't expand too quickly. No, it's fine. We're on top of it. Ooh.
All right, so this is gonna be liquid water. Am I gonna ranch, going to ranch the space chickens? Yeah, we're gonna try some ranching, see how we get on. Could be good. Could be good, might not be, I don't know. Muckroot nutrient bar is all we found so far. We gotta do some farming eventually too. Next settler to be called Hurdy Dirty. Why? There, I know, there is some piss. There is some piss, we're aware of the piss, and we're gonna be cleaning up. Also, let's set these to a priority nine, so that when they get clogged, somebody drops everything they're doing and unclogs them. This bug, though. This bug. Okay, let's get this bonus here as well, right? Prior priority. We're gonna make this a priority nine situation. We need to get this this door up and running. I don't know if it'll block the light, but at least it'll prevent him from going in there, right? He's stuck in here now. Okay, let's leave this one open so he can get out. Nope. Okay. He knows he wants to be near the beds. Just wants to ruin everybody's fun. This, this bug won't stop until he's ruined everybody's fun. Um, so this is going to also be a priority in here, as is this, and these bits here, and all the rest of this junk. So once this is all opened up, then we can empty this. We don't mind that we can empty this into here, right? It'll, and it'll fit. Just don't want anybody drowning down here. Usually dupes are pretty good at, uh, at not drowning. If you have the, uh, they know their limits, right? If you have the infrastructure, they'll use it. We got a bit of hypothermia, I think. Priorities. So we don't want anybody doing researching ever, except for um, Kenny Nyan, Kenny Nyan Cat. Is Kenny Nyan Cat, the one. Science skill minus one. No. We're, we had somebody who was interested in science, but we don't know who the uh, who it is until we go into skills and see, right? Um, it looks like it was actually um, whoever this is. Who is this? Vitaloni. No, this is uh, Panda Bear. Panda Bear is the one who likes to do uh, research, so we'll skill him into it. Kenny Nyan Cat also likes to do a little bit of uh, research, but will probably be our farmer to start with. And then we have um, Rob XD here, who is uh, not really good at anything, but maybe we can do some decorations. Get some decorations. Rob XD is just kind of use useless, unfortunately. Yeah. Why did we even bring him? You gotta wonder. Why did we bring this guy with us? You know? We just need DJ Egger. Okay. What about Mubinski? We need to make somebody who's good at digging called Mubinski, right? It's the way. It's the only way. Where is Mubinski anyway? Just watching some other stream. This never shows up anymore. <laughs> Been banned. He's watching unapproved streams as well. That makes me angry. That makes me really angry. I am angry. Look at this. Look at these levels. Look, they can work down here, no problem. We're gonna want to change, it's a, uh, stupidly, well, not, maybe not actually. We're gonna change these walls into airflow tiles eventually. 
so that we don't just have like a bunch of carbon dioxide collecting down here in the tank, you know? Does that make sense? Yeah, I'm pissed. I'm pissed, look out. When I get pissed, there's no going back. Okay, pretty good. Looking, looking nice, looking tight. Looking nice and tight. Get some science down in this little, uh, in this, in this little cubby here. Have to dig all this out too. And once they're done the priority stuff, then they can just start working on all of the other crap, right? This whole game is like one of the latest episodes of The Expanse. Why, do they dig out um, a gigantic asteroid? Do you know what? I still I haven't really watched the last season or the most recent season of The Expanse. I was like really into it that I just um, started watching dumb YouTube videos about growing vegetables and stuff. I don't know why. The bug still isn't out. I know nobody's sleeping tonight, by the way. Check this out. Let him out. We should do a red alert. Get him out of there. Look at this. He's keeping everybody awake. It's like the fourth night on the trot. <laughs> Poor guys. I like how they jump up and go out the top, but then they use the bottom here. Oh, they used to use the bottom as well. It's funny, isn't it? Good job, Rob XD. Look at Rob XD's first one back on site, doing all the work. That's how you do it. Doing some some cool underwater. Okay, imagine. Look at my shower thought for today is. And this is the first thing I thought about when I woke up this morning, okay? I woke up this morning, I opened my eyes, and I thought, Man, they should make a Subnautica movie. Am I right? Though, that'd be fucking awesome. Just like a really cool underwater adventure. That would be awesome, yeah. I would watch that. Or a series would be pretty good too, actually. Living under the sea, building a cool base, beating some aliens and stuff. Hell yeah. Aquaman, the Marvel movie. No, I don't want to watch a Marvel movie, though. That's the thing. I, I want to watch Subnautica, the movie. Directed by M. Night Shyamalan. With, I want there to be a real cool twist at the end. You know? Christopher Nolan. Am I chatting shit about the beast that is Rob XD? Hey, until Rob XD actually learns how to do something useful around here, then yeah, I am. Alright, Rob? That's just how it goes. The twist was it was Earth all along. But that's Waterworld, though. Waterworld is, that's the twist, right? You find out, hang on a second. This is Earth and it's been flooded. He found New York City with his gills. That was, that was Waterworld. Waterworld's great, eh? Yeah. Okay, good job everybody. The big water tank is like kind of done. Uh, that means that we can start, um, digging all this out. And draining this water into here. We're gonna have a whole bunch of resources stuck at the bottom, but that's okay. We'll go down and get them after. There's gonna be a lot of, we're gonna do that after in this game, by the way. This game lends itself perfectly to doing things after. Now everybody can just have a break and do, uh, whatever job they want. Just, just kidding. We're going to start working on this so we can get research up and running. A procrastination game. Yeah. 
Water world is set on Earth. Yeah, it is. Sand. So much sand. Let's speed it up a lot. Let's go as fast as we can here. We've got a lot of jobs to get through, right? Look, we've left this door open so that this stupid bug can get out of here. we got a couple of people going to La Toilette. It's good. Look, sinks are all working. Everybody's done a nice big poop. Finish off the day. Um, the next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to get a manual generator. Let's get some batteries and let's also get a uh, research station and then let's power it all up, baby. And then at least we'll be ready to do some science. And uh, we're also going to want to get an oxygen diffuser. We're going to want to start creating some oxygen. Uh, we can start creating oxygen uh, from lower down, maybe. Maybe like at this level or something. For now though, let's just chuck it in here because we need it. We're gonna power this with this wheel and battery setup as well. Nice. Hey, the bug is out. Nice, okay, let's get this bad boy closed. Perfect. Hey, hopefully our guys can get a good sleep tonight. That'd be nice. Okay, let's set the priorities here again, because we want this stuff done, right? We also are going to need to have a tile here. We need to set some priority on that, too. Um, and then we're also going to get a storage bin or two set up here. Not this. And then we're going to put some uh, algae in there. Al algae. Algae. We're going to put some algae in there. Okay. We can now check out science. All right. Are you ready to have your mind blown? This is in the new DLC. Look at the science that you can do. Okay. There's lots of new stuff. These, all these with the stripes are new. Look, power outlet fitting, solar panel module, a battery module. I don't know what any of that stuff does. We'll have to check it out. There's a steam engine, which I think is new. There's a large cargo bay, conveyor receptacle fittings, solid rocket port loader, a targeting beacon, interplanetary launcher, a drill cone. I don't know what that does. Like, there's tons of stuff. And you've got, like, the basic science, which we can do now. You've got the, the pink science, which you need a supercomputer for. And then you need different science. Look at this. Material science research. This is all spaced out DLC stuff. So this one here is like, uh, I think, orbital research. One of them is orbital research. Oh, no, sorry. This one, is, uh, this one is atomic research. And then this one is orbital. Um, and you need those, so you need atomic research for like some of this stuff. You need orbital for some of it as well to get into like the, the more advanced stuff. It's, it's, it's nuts, eh? There's a lot of new stuff. It's a big, big DLC. It's lots of, lots of cray, crazy, cray new stuff to get into. Um, so it'll be fun. It'll be fun to look into all that. Cryofuel propulsion. Look at this. Improved hydrocarbon propulsion. High velocity destruction. Pressurized forging, a diamond press. I don't know if that's been in the game for a while, but anyway. Um, so research wise, the first thing that we wanna maybe research is um, interior decor. No, let's get farming up and going, I guess, would be the, would be the obvious one. We'll get meal preparation too, so that we don't need to use the planters. We can use the, the actual farm tiles. And then we can get the egg cracker, the electric grill, and the mess table, too. So we'll do, like, a double whammer here. Um, 
who's we can just let whoever wants to do research for now do it until somebody skills up and then we can apply points oh wait never mind uh panda bear is going to be our research guy so that this will give him plus two science and make it so that he can actually use the supercomputer or should we give it to kenny uh kenny can do farming though Oh, but Panda Bear can do construction, which would be pretty good. And then we need to get somebody who can do um, digging, right? So maybe Kenny can be our uh, research person and Panda Bear can be... I think farming is probably more important than construction at this point, though, right? We'll get farming first. Okay, Panda Bear is going to be our research person. He loves research. Nice. We're going to give him a research hat. And Kenny is going to be a farmer. And we're going to give Kenny a farming hat. And Rob XD is going to um well i guess rob xd could become a mechatronics engineer eventually so we can give him an improved tinkery which is uh, plus two machinery but maybe to start with uh rob xd um in some bid to be somewhat useful can uh be um can get improved carrying one supplying more carry capacity and more strength you know because like right now we don't need a mechatronics engineer. Like we will eventually, but we don't need one now. So we're gonna give him improved carrying and we're gonna give him a nice cap to wear too. Nice. I think morale uh, should be pretty good because we got the bedroom and the bathroom, right? Let's build this floor here. Let's give it a bit of a priority of six so that it actually gets done. And uh, let's go into priorities now, and we're going to say Panda Bear is on research. Nobody else does research. Uh, Kenny is going to concentrate mostly on farming. And Rob XD uh, has no real priority right now. And hopefully we get somebody that can do some good digging here. So we have one here. Um, we have a, a lady here who is good at digging and tidying and has plus four excavation and plus three strength. Uh, the only downside is that she has a small bladder. That's okay. We don't mind if they're pissing. We have toilets for them pissing. They, they, there's, they do some, they'll do some good pissing. Okay. Who's this going to be? DJ, DJ Egger. Okay. DJ Egger, you're in. Yeah. We got him. We got him. Her. Okay. So skill wise, we want you into hard digging straight away. Boom. Nice. And we're going to give you the hard digging hat. We're also going to check your priorities and we're going to make sure that you are doing uh, digging as a, as a priority. And then with some emphasis on tidying, supplying and storing as well would be nice. Good. We got some, some nice research complete here. Panda bear is all over it. Good. We're generating oxygen. This is nice. We we needed it as well. Uh, there's some lock down here that we could uh, unleash. We can unleash the beast. Let's do that. We'll unlock some. And then uh, let's also unlock this trapped oxygen and uh, get rid of this, right? So this is going to be uh, a job for tomorrow on a priority six. We want to empty this out so that we can keep building over this way. And then we're going to look to empty this into here too. It might not fit. I'm not sure. It's quite a big water tank. It's good that you're generating oxygen because it's not included in this game. I know. I, um, I'm, I'm fully aware of the fact that uh, there's no oxygen included in this game. Um, okay. Algae. Copy settings. So that we can store algae in there as well. Once these jobs are done, hopefully we can start tidying up a little bit here. This is our base so far. It doesn't look great, but it works for now, right? We're starting to do some nice... Um, we're starting to make some big power moves here. Some power moves like Capone. Al Capone. Leaked. It's fine. It's fine. We want it. We want it in. We want this. We want to fill up this tank. Al Capone also had piss, pan 
piss pits. I thought you said piss pants there for a sec. I was going to agree. He probably did. He was a strange fella. Always pissing and shitting and, you know, eating. Like, what a, what a weirdo. Okay, research is done for now. Uh, this is on farming. Uh, we could go even further. Uh, no, we can't actually because we don't have the supercomputer. Uh, so next thing, let's go power regulation and internal combustion so we get coal generators when we need them. True, we'll probably want them kind of soon. Want to power some stuff? We want to get busy? We want to get real busy? Once we get jumbo batteries, we can replace these two little ones and get a big one. Is this no sweat or survival? This is just survival. All right, here we go. Look at this. Kenny's cleaning up this piss. Good job. DJ Ager is... Look at how fast DJ Ager can dig. That's some incredible digging. That's so good. Look at that. Very quick. Just cutting through it like butter. Job DJ Ager. That's what we expect around here. And Panda Bear is just blasting through the research. Look at that. We got the big batteries now. Um, let's um, let's let's build one. Let's build a jumbo battery. Hook it up here, next to here, and then we can decommission the old ones, right? Let's get this on a higher priority so that they build it. Oh no, too late. Well, it looks like everybody's going to get a good night's sleep because this bug is, like, up here causing causing problems instead of uh, near the bedroom. What a battery blaster. Nice. Look at that. Sleeping like a baby. No problem. Oh, okay. Look, the morale boost from a good night's sleep is going to be incredible. They're going to be so happy. They're going to be so happy to wake up. It's like having a newborn baby, this thing, right? Just keeping you up all night long. You can't even sleep. Hey, all my potatoes are growing, chat. Every single one. All four seeds have uh, produced shoots and they... And they man, they have busted through the soil last night. I went out to, uh, to water and like... All of the, like, the top layer of sort of, uh, like, the compost that had kind of hardened busted right through. So we're going to have some, at least, at the very least, if nothing else, we're going to have some potatoes. Yeah. We're going to have some, some, some freshly, freshly homegrown potatoes. We cut those shits up and air fry them or boil them or mash them or put them in a stew. Like, there's a million things you can do with them. Fresh from my own garden. Terry's been eating fresh from the garden as well. Look at that. He's coming back for more. He's just like, I love organic food. Come on, Terry. Show him what you're made of. Show us what you're working with. Shake your ass. Watch yourself. Shake your ass. Show us what you're working with. See, look at that. Going for it. Loves it. He loves the organics. Huge fan. He's a big fan. All right, good. We can start tidying up a little bit. We've uh, unlocked this uh, trapped oxygen. Equally, we've also unlocked this trapped ox oxygen here too. We're going to make this platform stretch and stretch to here too. And then we're going to do the, uh, the old ladder system on the side here. Tank. We're gonna flank the tank. Yeah, and then once that's all done, we're gonna dig this out too. We're gonna need to do some more research now that we have the big batteries. Um, let's uh, next do employment. We can get the crafting station and water cooler, which then leads into uh, advanced. So we get the mini pod, the supercomputer, the skill scrubber, and the telescope. Also, brute force refinement we're going to need for, like, the advanced metals or whatever. 
Um, I think let's go into uh, plumbing and sanitation first. Let's get the mesh tile and then we can uh, start working on getting like a, a, a better bathroom setup, right? With plumbing. We're doing it. Are you going to drain the top pool into the main tank? Yeah, I don't know if it's going to fully fit though. That's the only thing. We'll have to see. <laughs> a mega piss tank. Yeah, we're gonna have to start collecting all this piss soon, too. We're gonna drain the piss out of here, too. Uh, this is like one of the things I like about this game. Oh, hey, cool. Look at this. We got a cool steam vent here. So we're good for water. We'd be able to pump some of this water up into here or use it. Um, it's gonna be uh, warmer water. It's gonna be hotter water, so maybe we're gonna use that hot water for like oxygen production or something. Don't forget to hook up the large battery. Thank you very much. I almost forgot. Let's get this bad boy hooked up. Once it's hooked up, we can then look to uh, get rid of these ones. We'll get rid of these now, actually. Uh, same with in the power. Let's get rid of these wires to reclaim back some of our resource. Yeah, you don't want the you don't want to be piping warm water in through the base because it'll heat up the base, right? You got to keep it cool for farming and shit like that. You got to keep some cool farms. You want to keep you want to keep the farms nice and cold. Um, speaking of which, some farm tiles down here, I think, and then we'll plant some uh, some of this stuff, mule wood. We don't. We currently do not have a food source. Tell one of my guys to murder the shine bug. No, oh, no, it's fine. It'll die soon. Look, it'll die of old age. It's nine years old. They can only live to twenty-five. It's almost. He's almost halfway there. Look at this. What is this guy doing? Who is this? DJ Ager. Trapping himself in over here. Panda Bear is just doing some, some gentle uh, exercise this morning. Filling up the jumbo battery. Good job. Okay, in here we're going to get some mealwood planted. Which glitched out. Terry, what are you doing? Terry, no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> what are you doing? That's not your shell. He's taking taking his house with him. Choose a blueprint. Uh, we have somebody who's good at supplying, decorating, and operating, and we have somebody who's good at farming and cooking. Um, that could be good. Immune to food poisoning, increased decor, innately stylish, um, and is has decreased husbandry, which is fine, actually. Uh, it'd be good to have another farmer, and it would be good to have somebody who's good at cooking. Okay, who wants this one? We're gonna get, we're gonna get this person in. Nine, nine. Nine nine, okay, you're in. Nice. We're gonna need a bed for nine nine. We're out of beds. Good. Here we freaking go. Alright, so we wanna copy these settings and apply them here too. Start growing some food. So many researches complete. So that's the uh, toilets and stuff when we want to get those uh, installed. Um, 
lights increase duplicate work speed within a light radius. So I think actually having lights now is good. I don't know if it's always been that way, but uh, it would be worth getting lights, I guess, so we could put them over workstations and they'll just do things faster. It can't be a bad thing. Uh, before we do that, though, let's get into pressure management so we get airflow tiles. Lights used to be for mood. Okay, well, now they actually increase work speed. So there you go. You can make them sleep 10% faster as well. Even better. 99 had to sleep on the floor tonight, sadly. It's just, it, it do be like that sometimes. Where's the piss valve? We have not made a piss valve yet. We're working on it. We're getting towards our ultimate goal of uh, piss tanks, but it's taking some time. It's taking some time. We're, we're on it. We're, we're getting there. We are getting there. Okay, we're going to uh, build up to here as well. It's like around here, isn't it? Yeah. And then here. And then here. We're going to dig all this out. Internet is down. Wait, who lost the internet? How are you all here if the internet's down? Any plans for a piss asteroid? I mean, if the opportunity presents itself, yes, I'm down. I'm always down for a piss asteroid. Oh, Twitch is dying. All right. When did I start playing this, Dumbfist? I started playing this an hour ago. One hour ago, I started playing this. Reddit, Twitch, Amazon, and PayPal are all down. Oh. That's not good. This game has had a lot of updates since I last played, yeah. What's my goal in getting into a, into space for the amount of cycles? I don't mind. I'm like, just whatever. I'm just farting around. I don't have like any uh, any like strict goals. I just want to see some of the new stuff and do some ranching and some farming and stuff and clean up, core out the whole map and get it filled with oxygen and just create a nice space for my dupes to live in and stuff. Have I ever played Autonauts? No, I don't think I have, actually. Okay, research on uh, that stuff is done. So let's uh, let's get into this interior decor. Uh, we could go even further, but I, I think this stuff's kind of useless right now. Ice block, sculpting block. We don't really need any of this stuff right now. Um, we could do with having the uh, the smart stuff, though. So let's go into here. Uh, so we'll get interior decor and smart home. Uh, and then we can uh, start working on maybe filtration. We we want to get to this bad boy here for when the bathroom is set up, right? We want to get the water sieve. And then we want to get um, electrolyzer. Not so much the rust deoxidizer. So we'll get that after. <coughs> Pardon me. What time is it? Okay, good. Gotta keep an eye on the time. I got a busy day today. Got a weird, a weird and busy day today. Okay, let's get this in here like that. Let's build this over here like this too. We need some more farms. Dig all this out. Uh, we could probably just get some more farms down here. <clears throat> it should be pretty cool around here with this large body of water. System 32 was causing you some problems? Damn. Not, not System 32. You know, everybody's always talking about System 32, but what about System 33? You know? When's System 33 going to get a look in? Or System 69, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Aw, oh, look. Everybody's sleeping like a baby tonight. That's great. 
skills. <clears throat> nine nine. We said that you were going to get into uh, doing some cooking. But uh, for now, we're going to get you into uh, farming to help out with farming. And we're going to give you a farming hat and we'll turn you into a cook later. No one expects System 33. Oh, we want to make some more of these too, right? farm tiles okay research uh, is complete uh, for interior decorating so that means that we could get uh, where does this come under stations furniture ceiling light there we go I, you need to power them as well I'm, I'm sure yeah you do okay See if this actually works. What's my favorite variety of pepper? I like red bell peppers personally. That's just my personal choice. Don't don't judge me. Bell peppers are delicious. Yeah, I love them. There we go. Look, let there be light. We have a 10% speed increase on our research table. Panda Bear is loving it. Look at this, he's going so fast. Zoom. Research complete. Okay, what did we say was next? We wanted to get into um, air systems and we also wanted to get into um, supercomputer. We need to get the supercomputer soon, right? So let's do advanced research, employment advanced research. And then we can build the supercomputer. We'll have to build the light for it as well. Jalapeno for you. Nice. Jalepino. We've got a jalepino lover in the chat. Hands up if you like jalepinos yourself. I do. Me too. I'm, I'm, I'm launching my hands up into the air. Absolutely. Launching them. It's pronounced jalap jalapeno. Jalepino. I think it's actually Jalepino. Jalepinos. Jalepin. Jalep. Jale, Jalepinos. It's a tough one. I mean, I, I don't think there's a there's a I don't think there's an answer either way. I think it's just like you. It's kind of like GIF and JIF. You just just free. You just do what you feel like is is best, you know. In given the situation, just go for it. Okay, we're gonna be collecting a lot of uh, carbon uh, dioxide down here, which is fine. We can let it all pool down here, and then we can scrub it. We can scrub it, scrub it up, dub it all later. I don't know why I can't put a ladder there, but. There you go. Uh, we can either scrub it up, dub it, or we can grow some mushrooms down here. Underneath, uh, underneath here, it might be a good spot to grow some mushrooms. And then we can like uh, cook up some nice fried mushrooms for the dupes. A nice big morale boost. You know. Magical mushrooms. Mayhaps, yeah. You can store food in CO2. You cannot anymore. They changed it. 
Um, it, uh, there's, there's, there's two sides to uh, food degradation now. You, uh, you can still store it in CO2, but it needs to be refrigerated as well. Yeah, we changed it. The best way to store food now is to deep freeze it. It has to be uh, below minus 18 for it to not uh, to not spoil at all. Even in a refrigerator, there's a very slow spoilage. Yeah, crazy, eh? It happens. It happens. And the wheeze warts now emit radiation. Lots of it as well. Um, so you can use them for the... Um, for the... Um, for the atomic sun. I know this because I watched some videos. I was interested, so I wanted to see what I was getting into. And my brain is a sponge, and I've retained a lot of the info. I'm a wiki guzzler. Yeah. What a nerd, I know. I know. Uh, it's like, it's one of those games that's kind of good to know a couple of things before you start getting into it, right? Because otherwise, like, you just spend a lot of time making big mistakes and getting angry. I don't... Th that's not the life for me. Okay, let's copy these settings across here. We have even more food. Um, we have a big muckroot care package if we want it. We have somebody who's good at uh, athletics and suit wearing. We have a, a building, rocketry, and supplying, and doctoring. I'm taking the muck route. Huge. It's a lot of muck route. I got four wikis open and the rest. I got like 20 wikis open right now. There. Now we have we have a grand total of twenty nine thousand two hundred and seventy nine uh, cake cows for the people to eat. Cake cows. We're going to want to store some dirt over here as well. And I think what we could do is, because we got farms here and here, let's get two um, dirt storage bins so that they can fertilize the farms without having to travel too far to pick up dirt. And um, while we're at it, let's do another row of uh, farm tiles here, too. Get this built up. And then we can go just normal tile here and dig all this out. There we go. Good. So in here, we're going to have um, dirt. And we're going to copy these settings to here as well. Because there's lots of dirt probably laying on the ground. Can you grow Afghan here? No, I don't think so. Well, maybe. I don't know. There's a lot of updates, so it could be that we can. Where do we want to get our first piss pool set up? Maybe over here somewhere? close to the piss. We got a whole bunch of chlorine in here that we can use to help us um, get rid of slime lung and shit down in these polluted uh, biomes and possibly up here too. Maybe we, maybe we start digging from the top down and we just um, we just get a whole bunch of uh, chlorine down there to, to help out. We can make the supercomputer now. Uh, we do need brute force refinement, so we can always get that. Medical equipment, air systems we need, uh, filtration we're going to need. We're, I mean, we need all this stuff, so we, we might as well start researching it while we get some of the stuff set up. Here we go. We'll get brute force refinement in, and then let's get a, um, a supercomputer set up. 
get the supercomputer set up here. Let's get it powered up. And then we'll also get a light above here too. So we want furniture, ceiling light. Even though this stupid bug is in here providing light, we, we're going to get the ceiling light too. Um, and then let's copy the settings from here and get some more of these bad boys planted. We should have plenty of seeds. You gotta start working on toilets soon. Once the supercomputer's up, we can uh, research the uh, water sieving. Isn't that a lot of food for five dupes? It is, yeah. But we're, there's gonna be more than five dupes and we're gonna need some food. Are you guys having some big, um, big net outages? Look at the supercomputer. We're ready to go, baby. No? Oh, okay, good. Good to know. Um, we could maybe dig sideways. There's a lot of polluted oxygen over here. There's some lockers and stuff. We want to try to find the edges of the map. We know what's up and down, but we don't know what's to the side, right? We just don't know. Okay, research is complete. So we can actually start researching uh, advanced stuff now that we got the supercomputer. Um, we want to get uh, distillation, right? And filtration is something that we need anyway. So we'll go into that. There we go. Panda bear is just going to be researching uh, like a demon constantly. His, his soul... Raison d'etre is, uh, is, is this research. He's a researcher, Harry. What's controversial about Jalapeno? I don't know. Nothing. Nothing. It's fine. It's good. Everybody loves, everybody loves Jalapeno. Everybody loves Jalapeno. Okay, we're going to make a tank on this side too. We're going to keep the base nice and nice and organized. We're going to try to at least keep the base nice and organized for once. We're going to need DJ Egger with his uh, exceptional um, digging skills. Panda Bear is ready to do some uh, field research or some astronomy researching. If he goes into field research, he could do um, this material science research, which is the, the atomic stuff. Uh, if he goes here, he can do orbital. So I think we want one of, we, we need another researcher. We want one that can do um, one and one that can do the other. There's a lot of research to do now. So I think we need uh, two. Uh, so let's get him into here so that he can do geographical analysis as well. Um, and then, um, and then get him into the atomic research after. Okay, Panda Bear, good. And Rob XD, um, can do some more, um, carrying too. Or do we want to get Rob XD into improved tinkering operating? Yeah, maybe we do want to have this. Oh, there's a fly in here. Gross. Okay. There you go, Rob XD. He's taken a skill in something he loves so much. We do need, uh, tinkering and operating now, right? We got the wheel and stuff. <clears throat> there you go, Rob. Finally, you're like uh, almost a little bit useful, but not really still. Still not really that useful. Um, if we want to up uh, up things a little bit as well, we could get a, a nice big mess hall done. We could start working on the bathroom. Uh, we're not going to be able to... Well, we can probably plumb it. Uh, we just need somewhere for all the, uh, for all the poop to go. Unless... Unless we just process the poop. 
uh, let's we turn the poop into clean water and then just dump the clean water into our tank and then use it again for the for the system. I think um, I think the way that we used to do it was we would uh, we would like we we would prime the system with a bit of clean water to fill up all the sinks and the toilets, and then we would uh, take the polluted water and turn it back into clean water and then feed it back through the the system but i don't think it produces enough right i think you're i think you'd be you you wouldn't have an you wouldn't have enough water or it produces too much polluted water one of the two you'd reuse the poop water as plant water hey chris thanks hey no problem yet another bloody game i'm going to watch you play and have to buy you haven't you bought bastard. this yet so for the inconvenience, can you please call your next character Caddy Boy? Ta. Two underscore Terry shit in a thimble. Um, Caddy Boy, hey, thanks for the 10. Yeah, I will. So it produces too much water. Too much polluted water. So basically, we'd have to have some overflow of polluted water. Recycling the wastewater out of the toilet generates more water than it uses because it cycles 100% of the water it pollutes, plus the pee from the dupes. All right, okay. So we, we we could recycle the water, but we would have uh, we would have to store excess polluted water. We'd have to put it into a big piss tank somewhere. But then at least the at least the toilet system wouldn't draw from this fresh water, right? Okay, we'll do that then. We'll we'll go for that. Let's get the toilets and stuff set up to start with. We'll make a big bathroom in the middle here, I think plumbing so we want to have some sinks so we want some lavatories and we want to have some sinks and the sinks we want near the doors right so let's say we have like two sinks here and two sinks here and then we have one two three four we'd have toilets in between four toilets that's gonna work out real real nice actually I think okay so let's get to some toilets in here And then we'll get the doors. And then we'll say that this goes this way. And this one will go this this way. Yeah? Five toilets and four sinks. If we wanted to just have four toilets and four sinks, it's fine. We could delete this one in the middle and then put some statues in there to jazz up the bathroom. That's a lot of shitters, I know. I know. That's a tremendous amount of shitters. More shitters than I know what to do with. Alright, good. So, plumbing wise, we'll have some liquid pipes. We're gonna want to feed water into here, for sure. And then we want the waste to go out. So water, this water, this is fresh water in. And then this is going to be pee water out. Pee water. Um, where do we want to do uh, some of this, the, the pee water stuff and the, oh, uh, you know what, let's do it up here. We don't want to generate heat down here by the farms, we want to keep it nice and cool down here. So we'll do it up here instead, it's fine. We'll have like a little room in here, dedicated to, to doing this. Let's get this here too. And then we want to have the, we have a blueprint that we can choose. Uh, operating plus nine machinery, decorating plus eight creativity, suit wearing, athletics, cooking, cuisine, irritable bowel, irritable bowel, and unpracticed artist. Decreased creativity and increased decor morale bonus. This is, uh, this is somebody with plus nine machinery. I don't think we want any of this stuff right now, right? We need somebody else who's good at digging. We need an, another excavator. Good thing I made new shitters for all that IBS. I don't. We're not going to take any of this stuff. 
we're not taking any of these guys. They're no good. Okay, let's keep the research train going. Flow redirection, liquid distribution, liquid-based refinement processes, uh, and air systems. Leading into advanced sanitation, a decontamination shower. Oh, that sounds cool. Oh, my tra-la-la. -la. My ding-ding-dong. Um, a trailblazer module and an orbital microlab. We want to get into this material science research, right? The rad bolt reflector generator material study terminal. Um, so that we can start uh, generating some atomic stuff. There's a notification system. There's a hammer and an automated notifier. I don't know what any of that does. Oh, another thing that we want to get into is uh, ranching and stuff too, right? Critter sensor, incubator, fish trap, and a critter trap. So we want... Um, let's get into animal control because then we'll get the rest of agriculture. Refrigerators for food and stuff. And then ranching too. So we'll do this big chunk of research here. What mods am I using? I'm not using any. I'm not using any mods. Look at all this farming. Here we go. Look at this. Good job. Look at all this food. Loving it. Um, refinement? We're going to want the uh, the water, water sieve. Yeah. Um, we're going to want to plumb this, this thing up as well. So... We want um, the waste to go in here, and then we would like the um, output to go down here. And when there's too much overflow of uh, waste, because this pipe is, uh, is filled with beautiful fresh water, uh, we will overflow into like some tanks which I don't think I have the means for yet. So we're going to have to get the liquid storage, right? Maybe I do have liquid storage? No, I don't. Okay, so we'll have to get liquid storage next. That's okay. That's fine. Poo tanks. Well, we can either put them into poo tanks or... Because we're going to be collecting all this poo water down here into a big tank. We could uh, collect it down here as well, right? Uh, we could just uh, we could just have this pipe down and and drip slowly into here. We're gonna have a big piss tank down here. Poo poo and pee tanks. Been ten great years watching your vids, and I'm just now watching live. What Some took me so long? Poop and pee. Poop and pee. Hey, uh, just another Chris. Thanks so much for the 15. I'm glad you're here. Uh, it doesn't matter how long it took you. The important thing is is that you're here now. Thank you very much. Thanks. Mucho appreciado. Okay, let's get some tiles in here because none of this stuff is working. And we need to have this on a priority 7. Nobody is able to access the shitters right now. And we're not plumbed in either. So, let's get on it. Let's get busy. There we go. Oh my god, one of the sinks is out of action. The timing is so bad on that. Look, she didn't even wash her hands. Gross. That's disgusting. Just in time for a new baby and me taking a break. <laughs> I know, yeah. Baby's due in like six weeks. Crazy. Crazy. Time flies, eh, when you're having fun. I'll be taking a break for sure. I'm not sure. I, it shouldn't be too long. Like, I I mean, I have to get back and, and do stuff. But, like, it'll be a little bit of a break for sure. New babies are no joke. They're no joke. Okay. Let's also get some mesh tile in here. I'm a big fan of the mesh tile. Rather than the ladders. Paternity leave granted. Thank you. Thank you very much. Eight weeks. No, it won't be eight weeks. We got a colony achievement. What's this achievement? Outdoor renovations, bed and bath. There you go. Nice. How many babies do I have? I have two right now. 
we're having a third. And then and we have Terry as well. Terry seems upset. Look, he's just left his he's left his cage in a in a real state. Bit greedy just because my dick works. <laughs> hey, I can't help it that my dick works, okay? I'm thrilled about it, but at the same time, it causes me um, a lot of hassle as well. Do you think that this water will fit in here perfectly, or do you think it'll, like, overflow a little? I think it'll overflow a bit. You think it'll fit? I don't know, it looks like a lot of water. It'll overflow a lot. That's what I'm thinking. I think in, there's going to be some, some definite overflowing. Am I having a boy or a girl? I am having a um, baby. We don't know yet. You'll know when the baby's born. I'll tell you. Okay. It's a fifty-fifty. It could be one, one, one or the other. <clears throat> You've got a pretty good chance of guessing what it's going to be. Right. Let's get this done by four. Um, and then we go like so. And... Like so. Let's cancel that. Um, and then let's dig all this out too. It's the end of the day once again. Why do the meal lice look like unbaked croissants? I don't know. It's a it's an alien world. It's just the way it is. I mean, you know, sometimes you just got to think. Hang on. I'm glad that this is this is the way. Um, let's make this the same size. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So we're going like that. Okay, and what we'll want to do first is uh, remove this layer. Oh gosh, what am I doing? I wanted to dig all that. We want to remove this layer down here first. And then start em and then start emptying it in, right? So we'll have a ladder that spans across here, and then we'll have a ladder that goes like that too. So the tank will be the same, but it'll be this one will be filled with piss. All of this piss is gonna work its way down into here, right? We'll find a way to pump some of this chlorine up out of here, store it, and then we can use it to uh, kill all of the shitty germs and stuff in here. We'll try to. Try not to make too much of a mess of all this polluted oxygen. We'll scrub it. We'll scrub it first. Some shit germs. Yeah, no. Don't want any shit germs. Okay, we're going to have to build a water pump down here. We're going to have to uh, pump a little bit of water into this system first. This is going to need to be powered temporarily. We have more power requirements now. And uh, Panda Bear is still researching away like crazy. Stack Overflow is down. PP hands. Guess I can't work. Really? Stack Overflow is uh, is is actually a great resource, isn't it? Do you like if you work in IT? Um, why is a wire there? What the hell? Yeah. 
Any takers? Did I accidentally build that there? I didn't mean to. Uh, we need somebody who's really good at constructing as well, right? And uh, we'll, we'll need a rancher too. We want to start ranching up some of these hatches. What's the what's the what's the thing you want to do with hatches? You want to get stone? Is it stone hatches? As many of them as you can get to make coal. Don't worry, guys. Fanfiction.net is still up. We're good. <laughs> Thank God for that. Man, I was really worried that Fanfiction.net would be down. God, I'd need Fanfiction.net to be up. Okay. Let's run this pipe up here. Nope. We won't connect it up just yet, though. We'll connect it up when we're good and ready. Which means that we're going to be getting rid of the old shitters. Out with the old, in with the new. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's see if we get some good here. We have um, machinery, cuisine, agriculture, husbandry, construction. We've got ranching and construction it's pretty good abe he's got a bottomless stomach and he's an ugly crier and a balloon artist but actually two good things right okay we're gonna accept abe into the colony who wants to be this one dj cookie okay dj cookie dj cookie dj cookie okay you're in um, good. Okay, so skills straight away. We want uh, you to be doing... Because we don't need you to ranch straight away. DJ Cookie, we want you to do construction. First. Okay. So we'll get you down the construction. And then demolition will be useful for us as well. So we'll get you into construction. Kenny, um can go into uh, crop tending and micronutrient fertilizer crafting, sure. And um, we also have DJ Egger who can go into super hard digging. You can mine abyssalite, we'll need that. And 99, uh, we want you into, um, we could actually get you into, uh, into, into critter ranching as well, but let's get you into crop uh, tending for now as well, okay. We have two, two farmers. I don't. Maybe that's uh, not really required. Let's start. We'll see. Make a bed. We need to make a bed. Yeah. Okay. So, um, DJ Cookie, we want you doing building, and then we want you doing ranching as well. You won't do anything else. Building is a priority because he's good at it. And then ranching when there's not much building to be done. Give them their promotion hats. Improve farming one. Crop tending. Oh yeah. Panda bear. Advanced research. Field research. There you go. Field research. Rob XD. Nothing. Uh, Kenny. Crop tending. DJ Cookie, nothing. DJ Egger, super hard digging, nice. Okay, hat upgrades complete. They're all so happy about these hats. Any weed selling later today? No, today is a weird one. I have to go kind of soon. And then I'm going to take a break and come back at 5 o'clock for this mind draft European thing. We're doing the Minecraft PvP thing at 5 o'clock. Yeah, we're gonna... I've got to go at 2. Yeah. How are we for oxygen? Not bad. Not bad considering it wasn't even included. Uh, we'll be able to get some more algae. There's tons of it. So we shouldn't really run out of algae. We want to continue digging into here and 
getting all of this dug out so that we can get polluted water stored in here. But for now, we can... Um, research is done. Let's get those liquid liquid tanks wherever they are. They're in here somewhere. Where could they be? Where are the liquid tanks? Um, that's not them. They're... Um, um, uh, here. Improved plumbing. Uh, we could just go into liquid tuning as well, because we're going to need radiant pipes and all this crap as well, right? But here's the liquid reservoir. Okay. Good. One game you should get is Hell Architect. It comes out tomorrow, a lot like this game. Oh, I'll have to check it out. I haven't even heard of it. Hell Architect. Do you have to design hell? In it? In it, mate. In it. Just fucking fly. Okay, good. We're in good shape here. We got it. We got the the start of a nice base. It's only taken us an hour and forty two minutes to get to this point, but we're very close to having uh, toilets, properly plumbed toilets. We're still missing some pipe down here. We're awaiting a delivery. Hell Architect looks like this game cloned? Jeez. Oh, I forgot to build an, an extra bed. Where's our new dupe and where are they sleeping? Oh, on the floor here. Nice. We'll have to get another bedroom set up. We might move some of this, this oxygen production down a ways. Uh, for now, let's just make sure that they have a bed by digging this out and putting a bed there should be fine here we go look at this look at him go that's some drilling Um, let's get this built as a priority. So that DJ Cookie has somewhere to sleep tonight. There we go. Nice. Very nice. And very tight. Um, good. Liquid pipe. Let's hook this thing up. Um, let's let it pump a little bit, and then let's, um, disable the building. Should be enough. Should be more than enough. Perfect. Okay. Will I stream any E3? I probably won't, no. Um, pipes... We can get rid of these pipes from here. So this won't need to go up here anymore. And then we'll empty out the... We'll let the pipe empty out and then get rid of the rest of it after. Sound good? Good plan? Good plan. Hey, Panda Bear didn't put his new hat on. He hasn't had a chance. Okay, it's time to get rid of these toilets and sinks. So they, it forces them to use the new stuff instead. We don't need these crappy old outhouses anymore. Wonderful. We got some gross poop water here. Gross poop water. Really gross. Let's get some mesh tile in here. 
Um, and uh, actually, we can dig this out. We're gonna we're gonna unleash a lot of polluted oxygen though, which I want to be ready for. I want to get the scrubbers in place because I don't want too much polluted oxygen going into the base. We want to control the flow of polluted oxygen. So I think what we'll do is we'll get one here. Uh, I haven't even unlocked them yet, so we'll we'll try not to be too hasty opening this up. We got another colony achievement. This time it's Royal Flush. Nice. Okay, we'll finish off this um, research and then we'll get those uh, the the um, scrubbers, the air air scrubbers. We're pl we're producing some um, polluted oxygen here because of all these like polluted dirts and polluted waters and stuff, but not. Not a tremendous amount. We'll get rid of them. We'll sweep them up soon. How's this research going? It's almost done. Okay, good. Good job. Good job. Great job. Great job. Great job. Oh, we need a mess hall too, right? Should we make a really big mess hall? Get some fridges and stuff in here too. Uh, furniture. Some mess table. How many guys do we have? Six right now. It's uneven. It's gotta be like that. Okay, and we'll get a couple of fridges and stuff in here too. Uh, we get a, uh, a water cooler. Let's get a water cooler and a, fl a flower pot too. To upgrade the decor. Good, they're gonna love eating up there. They're gonna love it. They will enjoy that. They will really enjoy that. Okay. Is this built? What can we put in here? A briar seed? Sure. Let's get a briar seed in there. Let's cancel that. I think we have a briar seed. Nice. Look at that. It's, it's all good. So this room is now a great hall. Look at that. The morale bonus is huge for that. Great. All it took was a uh, was the water cooler and a plant. You get a free great haul. The morale is going to be a, a big boost. It's going to be a huge boom. Briar Seed is a nice name. Is that like your last name or something? Johnny Briar Seed. Okay, so plumbing wise, we're not producing any excess. There's no. There's no. Um, there's no poop water stored in the uh, in the system right now. It's good. We're working on a way of getting rid of the excess as well, right? I'm fucking fly. Gross. Okay, good. That research is done. So let's get. Uh, decontamination, right? We can get the carbon skimmer and the deodorizer at the same time. Be good. And then we'll we'll get some um, insulation stuff done too, right? We have suit wearing, athletic, supplying, and strength, doctoring, cooking, and another snazzy suit. Let's print the snazzy suit and give it to um, DJ Egger. There you go. Put that on. Gonna love that. Skills, we don't have anybody that can skill up, but look at the morale. We have 10 morale. 9, 10, 11. Our morale is really good right now.
Perfect. Okay, so once we can get um, uh, like a, a an air thing in here, we'll be good. And we want to dig all this out too. We have a bunch of chlorine trapped at the bottom, which is fine. We could start storing some chlorine. Get like an air thing, an air filter, and start storing chlorine in tanks. Um, and then we'll just empty them, empty the chlorine out at the top here, and then just eat up all the slime lung and shit, right? As we as we mine down, I don't think we really need to get um, suits, uh, like e e e EVA suits or anything like that just yet. We only really need them for if we're going into space and if we're gonna go down to get oil and stuff, right? Where it's too hot. We can try to keep things nice and uh, nice and uh, airy, so that they don't necessarily need to use suits in the middle, you know. Get some nice, get some nice oxygen in there. Okay, research complete. So that means that we can get, oh no. That was not the right research. Wait, what? Oh no, it's only one research, right? It's not a, more, a recent research complete. Okay, this is gonna be a big piss tank in here. Chlorine is barely poisonous. Well, it's gonna get rid of all the germs too, right? That's what we want. We don't want any, look at like slime lung. Actually, slime lung is not much of a concern anymore. It's zombie spores is the big one now, right? Slime lung, they've nerfed it a lot, apparently. It's, it's like, it's not, it's not the killer it once was. Remember when we used to play? And it was like, any slime lung was like, oh shit, they're dead. I don't think it's like that anymore. It's just a very bad cold. Yeah, we can live with a very bad cold. That's no problem. Okay, let's get airflow tiles on the side here. And the side here as well. Make these all airflow as well. And then we can start getting this carbon dioxide shifted down here. And then once we can get the once we could get the polluted oxygen scrubber things in here, we can start opening this up and filling this up too. Uh, we also need to put some tile here and <coughs> just get some ladder in here too. Okay, that's the liquid reservoir. It looks like we're starting to store up a little bit of excess here. So we got this just in time. There, let's do that. Look at these nice airflow tiles. Look, so now all this carbon dioxide will float off to the side and then come down here into this big area that we have filled with CO2. Can I put a plant down there to convert the CO2? Yeah, we'll put a scrubber down here to get rid of it all. There's no point in keeping it now because we can't store uh, food and stuff in it anymore. We also need, um, we might need to get, um, coal power up and running soon. Like, it's, it's fine for now, I think, but these deodorizers now need to be plugged in as well. This is another new thing. So we'll have to run a wire over here. This is a new change in the DLC. We gotta plug those bad boys in. Okay, good. So now we are ready to um, plumbing. We want a bottle emptier here. And we want to get some mesh in here too. This is fine. Look at this, look at this thing go. It's already completely overwhelmed and the stuff is escaping. Hopefully it'll be able to get rid of it before it becomes too much of a problem. 
Okay, so this one is going to be polluted water. And we're going to put polluted dirt over here too by the scrubber. I mean, a little bit of polluted oxygen will probably get through, but because there was quite a bit of it. But we can put scrubbers like on the other side here too, right? Let's get another airflow tile, airflow tile in here, and we'll get one here too, and then we'll get um, some more deodorizers here, just to help out with all of this stuff coming through, because this guy's just going to be overwhelmed. Um, and let's also get another um, airflow tile here, and we'll get a storage bin here, and we'll fill it with sand as the filtration medium, right? Teenage polluted dirt bag. I'm just a teenage polluted dirt bag. Okay, the research must not stop though. Advanced gas flow, look at this, a carbon dioxide engine. It's, uh, this is like already the uh, beginnings of rocketry. A gas rocket port loader, a gas rocket port unloader. I don't know what any of this stuff does. It's all stuff that we'll explore together and try to figure out. It'll be great. Okay, ore scrubber and a desalinator we could get because we're going to need an electrolyzer and a rust deoxidizer pretty soon. We also want to get into um, this, the atomic stuff, right? And then we could maybe um, do a disease clinic, hot tub, radiation sensor. I think when you start getting into the atomic stuff, there's radiation and you might need to have doctors and stuff set up. You can make anti-radiation tablets and stuff now too. Space program, rocket platform, solo spacefarer, nose cone, orbital cargo module, rocket control station. Like there's so much new stuff. It's crazy. Okay. Let's go for this first because we know we're going to need to produce some oxygen uh, beyond this uh, this oxygen diffuser soon. Our levels are still pretty good for now in the space that we've carved out. And uh, it'll be even better once we start scrubbing this, um, this CO2 down here. Okay, let's get these bad boys plugged in so we can start dealing with this mess of polluted oxygen that's coming through. And this is going to be filtration medium sand. There, start storing sand in there so that it's close by when it needs to be refilled, right? Okay, and then we would like to also get mesh tile all the way across here. And we can start then opening this up and dumping water into it how are we looking for germs and stuff here there's no slime lung out yet there might be a little bit exposed here but again it's not a huge problem and we have 86 kilograms of, p of piss water in there right now too pretty good pretty nice pretty tight how's my day going uh, it's going good so far yeah i'm having a, a great day Been nice. Been real nice. Um, let's get a some tile built here. And um, we're going to try to like get some tile built to like here as well. We need to move this bedroom set up probably up here. I think we're going to go for a bedroom setup up here so that it's not there. So let's go door and then we'll have more space for guys to live in here, right? So we'll go furniture and cots. We have nine beds in there now. Nine. 
So oxygen is included. We've include we've manually included it, yeah. We had to. It had to we had to include it. Okay, and here's a nice collection of uh pee and poop. This is our first pee and poop tank. Looking good. Let's drain this out here too. And Look at this. All the polluted oxygen has been scrubbed. Okay, who do we got here? We got somebody who's good at piloting and cuisine, athletics and machinery, machinery, creativity and agriculture, and we have some thimble reed seeds. Thimble reed seeds? Uh, we need thimble reeds, right? We could uh, we could use the uh, the contents of our, um, our, our piss water um, and start uh, a thimble reed uh, farm. We don't need any of these dupes. So we'll grab the uh, the seeds and we'll make uh, some thimble reed farms up here. We're gonna need for that hydroponic farms. Let's get those in with some plumbing, some liquid pipes. Uh, we wanna empty all this out first. And then we'll uh, we'll hook it up. Set up priorities for what? We don't need any right now. I mean, priorities are fine. I'm happy for these guys to be working on the stuff that they're working on. It all needs to be done. We're not we're not desperate for a fucking fly. I think in terms of people working jobs are good. Panda bear it seems to be poisoned somehow. What's wrong with him? Oh, he's got food poisoning. Okay, next up for research, we are going to actually go into here and do this new science. Did I hear correct? You said you are desperate for fucking fly? Yeah, I am. I'm desperate to fly. It's been like a, the pandemic has meant that air travel has not been a, a, a feature in my life, which is something that I was used to doing, and I've missed it a lot. I've really missed it. Okay, this polluted water, I want to sweep. This polluted water, I would like to sweep as well. Let's get it out of here. Is there any other polluted water? Is there anything else that's emitting fart bu bubbles anywhere here? Doesn't look like it. Need another scrubber in there. There's still a little bit of polluted oxygen going around, but not as much. Any future travels when I can fly? Um, yeah, most likely. I don't know where or when. I'm like, I'm so used to being at home now, I just want to be at home. I don't want to go anywhere. Um, guess who's coming over here, though? Uh, not, uh, this weekend, but next weekend. Uh, everybody's favorite, uh, Lebanese child. It's, uh, Louis. He's coming over. He's coming over for the weekend, yeah. There's no, uh, restrictions for traveling here. It's considered, uh, like uh domestic england so it's he can travel over here doesn't need to isolate nothing and he's been vaccinated as well so that helps is he gonna go cycling again i don't know what his plans are maybe i guess Make sure he does not poop on my toilet. No, he's not going to be pooping on my toilet. He will not. There will be no toilet pooping happening. Plant. Copy settings. Okay. 
we can start filtering some of this poop water into these farms here and grow some of these things. We're going to need them for suits and stuff later, right? Is he coming to play on my satisfactory save? Yeah, he wants to do co-op uh, satisfactory and he wants to fix up. He, he found some problems with my uh, save and he wants to... He wants to get in there and roll up the sleeves and get, get his hands dirty. Fix it up. Yeah, I know. This is this is the kind of guy we're dealing with here. Um in terms of uh power we're still using this jumbo battery and we're still using this wheel to fill it up. We could probably think about getting like a, a coal uh, generator set up somewhere. I don't know where. Maybe like at the bottom of the base. Maybe in like a warmer part of the base so that the, we're not generating a ton of heat inside our base. Which is like perfectly air conditioned right now. Pardon me, I'm yawning a lot. Yeah, we need to get the smart battery online for that too, right? We want to get automation so that it's not um, wasting a lot of coal. Because coal is finite. Twenty-four degrees would be uncomfortable. It's pretty hot, actually. Yeah, twenty-four degrees. You'd be a little bit sweaty. You want it like twenty-one, right? Twenty, twenty-one. Okay, here comes our first big batch of pee. It looks like we're gonna get a paku here as well. So we probably want to deconstruct this mesh tile. Get that Paku in there, and then we can maybe get some more Paku in there. Um, let's give this a priority of six so that it happens first. Okay, they got rid of those... Those pee bottles as well, that's good. And everybody's had a nice dump and a hand wash. Where do I store my PIRL? I usually store it actually um, my not in my balls. I um, I have some um, some bags implanted into my butt cheeks. I figure those things are so big, there's space in there, and I store all my pee inside those bags deep within my butt cheeks. Not bottles, no. no. I like to have I like to have pee on hand. Just in case, you never know when you're going to need some, you know? Come on, Paku. Into my, into my poopy water tank. Okay, let's let this all drain out. It's kind of gross. We have some more to drain out up here as well. Um, and the stuff that doesn't drain, we're just going to have to mop it up. There we go. Now he's going to flop into the tank. Uh, there, he can live in there. That's fine. Perfect. We could even feed him. He will eat some, uh, some algae. He likes to eat algae. He'll eat algae... Um, And he'll excrete polluted dirt. He'll do some polluted dirt. There's no slime lung in the air just yet. Start pumping some chlorine in here. Algae. 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 Oh, algae. Um, I think we can dig up here without making any big um, slime lung gaps as well. Do that. Drain all the water down into the into my big piss tank as well. 
Looks like there's even more pee and poo over here. You're gonna have to be mindful. What are these guys? Sweetles. What does a Sweetle do? Um, they're non-hostile critters that excre that excrete large amounts of solid sucrose. They have a diet of sulfur, and in exchange, they produce sucrose. Nice. That's, that's sugar. Yeah. That's right. It's sugar, baby. Alright, let's mine this all out. We can maybe start setting up some, um, some ranching in here. Get some hatches. Start working on some coal. Um... That'll expose some slime lung, getting rid of the slime here and the slime here. So I think um, I think we want to get uh, we want to get some chlorine like uh, pumped up here, and then we wanted we want the chlorine to like just push down in through this whole area, and then when once it's doing that, we can start excavating it out, keep it nice and clean. That's uh, that's what I think anyway. Uh, we could get to it from this side as well. Get to it from the top and then pump it out the bottom. There's already a whole bunch of chlorine down here. It seems to have pooled in here. Kind of gross. And uh, this is where we're going to pull a bunch of the chlorine from, right? And you get all this bleach stone as well, which can generate more. <clears throat> Who do we got? We got a, a care package of ice. Construction, agriculture, strength, construction, and medicine construction. Um, decreased germ resistance, requires light to sleep, and requires light to sleep. Do we just want some ice? No. Let's just reject all these. are all bad. I don't want any of this stuff. Yeah. It's gross. It's gross. Okay, research is all done. So we can start looking at the atomic stuff. Um, I guess we want to get, like, um, all this stuff. But we need the, uh, mechatronic, um, dude. Uh, what about, uh, oh, yeah, we need the smart, uh, the smart battery, right? Let's get that next, and then we can get some of this stuff done. Low-resistance conductors and, and such. And then we're going to try to feed some of this polluted water into uh, this irrigation system here too, right? So let's empty this out. Grow these. Bum, 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 bum. Hey, we're good for water. So we'll, we'll get rid of this tank eventually and then just have this uh well maybe we need the tank as a buffer because there's no way to prioritize this poop water going into here over say having a regular flow of it coming in as well so we'd want to buffer some of it up or after the tank is empty we just switch over to feeding it directly from here and this runoff will drip into here instead that would make more sense right i like that we're dealing with uh this this polluted oxygen as it's coming out of here we like tidy it tidy it all up man flies are so annoying aren't they god get out of here stop Stop! Why my face evolve? There's so, there's so much junk in this place. You go land on it and barf on it and wash your hands or whatever. Right on my face it has to land. He wants to lick me. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. They eat poop. I'm the ultimate junk. That's not nice. 
That's not nice. Okay, another thing that we're going to get set up down here is a uh, carbon skimmer. Let's get the carbon skimmer going down here. We'll get, just set it up in the middle here and start eating up all of this uh, extra CO2 that we're not planning on really doing anything with. I don't know if I really want to grow mushrooms necessarily. I think there's 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 better things that we could do with our time and energy than growing mushrooms and trying to like hang on to uh, perfectly uh, te temper te te temperatureized uh, carbon dioxide, right? Like normally, I just uh, send this stuff out into space, but if we can skim it as well, that would be good. All right, so we need some fresh water to come in here. Not even a ton of it, honestly. Like, a, a look at that. The tank is already empty. That's pretty good. We just need like a like a small amount, and then we can just output the uh, output everything into here. So we're gonna want a liquid vent here, and then we want to output. Um, this stuff into here right so we're gonna go like up here along the side like that this can come down here we'll hook that up and then we want to get rid of this tank and have this come down here instead um yeah no that's fine so then we're going to cut this off from here and we're going to uh, plumbing liquid pipe. This is going to run off here now instead. So we'll get rid of all this. Let's deconstruct this as well. And then pipes, that can go, and these can go too. Perfect. And then we can just get another pump in here and feed into this thing directly, right? Have I ever played Project Zomboid? Yeah, I played it. I played it. It's all right. Um, and this goes up into there like that. That's fine. So we're, let's get a. We can we can get a ranch in here. Does this come under stations? We want a grooming station. And then we want a uh, critter drop-off. And then we want a critter feeder too, right? We'll get some hatches in here. So critters hatch and hatchling. I don't think we have anybody who can ranch just yet, but we have skill points and lots of morale. We were saying that it was going to be Kenny who was going to do some ranching for us, I think. Kenny already has some husbandry? No, Kenny has none. So who was it? It was somebody new. Oh, yeah, it was uh, DJ Cookie. DJ Cookie is doing construction, and we want DJ Cookie to get into ranching as well. Husbandry, husbandry, husbandry minus three. So DJ Cookie, um, no oh man, we gotta get him into critter ranching. So we have to do farming first, and then critter ranching, or we find another dupe that is just good at ranching. Nine nine has minus three in husbandry. Yeah, it's a no go, a big no go. Okay, this thing just needs to be powered on now. Let's run some power down into this biatch. We can start scrubbing all this. Because look at, see, it's starting to accumulate. And actually, look, it's starting to rise up. So it'll keep going up. But look at this. Look at, see the airflow tiles? We got rid of all the carbon dioxide that was just pooling on there. It's really good. And then and the next step is going to be to get rid of all this polluted oxygen if we can. Or at least scrub most of it. Am I... Do I need missing water to the... 
Toilet? No, no. Toilet's fine. Toilet's on a closed loop. We got water. Um, this is meant to... Hey, this overflow is not working. Weird. Maybe I need like a, a bridge or something? So it seems to be getting caught here. Oh, is it because of this? Maybe it's because this is here. I might need to bridge onto it. Oh, yeah. Okay, we'll have to... We'll have to do a, a bridge onto this, I think. Okay. So plumbing. Um, hey, a liquid Chris, bridge. I thought you were naming a little dude after me. Or were Shit. you donation baiting again? No, I don't know if you... I haven't had, had anybody in. in. All right, that's it. You're out. You're not. You're not in now. You're not in. Don't rush me. Okay. I think if we put this bridge here, it'll work. I haven't. Uh, we haven't had any new dupes in. Hey, Caddy Boy, thanks for the ten. I appreciate it. This should still work now. I think. I think this. This will be fine. The pipe from the pump can go through the wall instead of over. No, I think. Um, I think we're good here. So this needs to be activated. There we go. And now we can start skimming the the CO2 at the bottom. Get rid of it. Here we go. This is going to be nice. We're going to have a whole bunch of chlorine uh, at the bottom here. But that's okay, because we can scoop it up and do something with it as well, right? We get, like, a, an air pump to, to get it all out. Back to the poop problems. Look at all the poop water we have here. Oh, this is going... Oh, I see. Look, it's trying to go up here now. So, actually, we've just made a split that we didn't we didn't really want. So this is going to all collect up here now, too. So we have to get rid of this. It's creating it, mo money, mo problems. This is the this is where we're at now. Mo money, mo problems. Two underscore. Hey, thanks, Caddy Boy. Thanks again for the 10. I appreciate it. I, s I think what we want to do is we want to have uh, the bridge be at, like, the connecting point here, right? So this is going to try to flow back in. That's fine. Okay. Let's let this all empty out. Okay, and then I think we want to have a bridge here. So let's get rid of these. And then we're going to go plumbing, liquid bridge, like so, pipe, like that. And then we go pipe, like that. Get rid of all this pipe. And let's see if this actually works. So we're waiting for people to flush the toilets up there. So that's working to get rid of all this stuff. And then we're just waiting for nighttime for them to all go to bed. Oh, we got another dupe here. Hang on a sec. Let's see. Caddy boy, you might be in. Uh, excavation, construction, agriculture, cuisine, supplying plus nine strength. Cannot do cooking errands. Excavation and construction as a, as a double whammy is kind of good. No? We need another uh, person who can dig and build. Okay, we'll get you in. Was it? Caddy boy. Okay, you're in. We already have a bed ready for him as well. Skills? Um, right, this, this, this opens things up a little bit for us. Because 
DJ Cookie is a fine rancher. So we're going to say that DJ Cookie is going to go into ranching. We could do a skill scrub on him, actually. Get rid of uh, his improved construction and then put him directly. He has a lust for ranching as well. So we'd be able to get the two points in there. And then Caddy Boy could then become uh, good at construction and digging as well. Okay, let's do that. We're going to put you into improved construction. Caddy Boy. And um, we'll set your priorities here too. So where's Caddy Boy? Caddy Boy is going to be uh, doing some building and digging. Digging first, building next. And a whole bunch of nothing else. It's fine. We have some research that we can set here too. What's next? What do we want next? Um, we can start. Let's just bash out this whole medicine tree so that we can get uh, hot tubs. Or do we want to get into um, temperature modulation and all this stuff instead? Maybe we do actually. Radiant gas pipes, gas reservoirs and stuff. Yeah, let's go. Let's go with that. That's a good one. That's a good one for us. The sliding pole. Yeah, we can do with a sliding pole pretty soon too. It'd be, be pretty nice. Okay, so this is going to be for hatches. And we don't want to feed them clay or dirt or meal ice or meat or fruit or mushroom or nutrient bars or sand or spindly grub fruit. Just sandstone for now is fine. They can eat some sandstone. Build a hot tub sauna and change the stream title to hot tub stream with chat. Then you'll be there. Nice. I will do that. Sounds good. Sounds good to me. Okay, so stations. What was it? We wanted a skill scrubber. Refunds a duplicate skill points for reassignment. Okay, good. Let's get this thing in here. I've never even used one of these before, but... I just know they exist, you know? Just know. Okay, it looks like um, it's nighttime and everybody has gone for a pee and a hand wash. So we produce the water and the overflow is not working. Once again, it will not go down to this bridge. There's like a trick for doing this, isn't there? Like there's a way to, to force it out. And I thought it was to do with the bridge, but I can't remember. How do we get this overflow to, to work? We need a second bridge. Use bridges to make one-way pipes. Um, force out the P. You need a bridge before the current bridge. So I need another bridge, like, off the back here. Oh, yeah, that's right. You need to use a... That, okay, yeah, I remember how to do it now. Okay, so you do it like this. We get rid of this. We put the... Um, we put this bridge... Here. Oh, no, wait, is that right? And then it goes like that. It's something like this, right? Like you put it here and then output it at the top. I think it's like this. Well, we'll try it and see. It's it's something like this anyway. I can't remember exactly how to do it. It's after? So this is just going to skip the, the sieve altogether. Okay, so we have to get rid of this bridge. Liquid bridge. Deconstruct. Okay, 
so this goes like this and then we say we get rid of these and then we have the bridge here like that and then we do the plumbing like this yeah so now it'll fill this up and then when it can't it'll overflow into here and then push down into here and then go into here right so it forces a one-way pipe okay good nice okay skill scrubber is good so we want to put uh, dj cookie in here dj cookie prepare for skill scrub and also let's see this thing working so we've lost a little bit of water. We top up on water and then any excess goes out the back. Perfect. That's working perfectly now. So we just have to monitor this pool filling up. Great. Okay, that's great. We're going to have to sort out power. We're going to need some separate... Um, circuit soon okay has this guy been skill scrubbed yet or is he on his way DJ cookie no he has not come on DJ cookie hop in <laughs> look they're just shaking He's just being shaken up. They're shaking the skills out of him. He's going to spend all day doing that. We ran out of battery. Oh, no. Oh, nine, 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 nine. That's bad. That is bad. Okay, let's get... Um, we're going to have to get a coal generator online. And we're going to probably want to have it down here. Let's get it set up down here so that it's not too close to the farms. Smart battery, we need some refined metal. So we're gonna actually need to get a, um, like a crusher down here too, right? A rock crusher. We'll power this. We'll do a naked power from here to here. Let's get rid of this as well. Let's get a nice jumbo battery here, too, that's hooked up to this. Um, and then let's feed some power... Hello? Up to the scrubber, too, so that we can get DJ Cookie ranching. And then we'll get the, uh, the, smart, uh, the smart battery on, on this network instead after, right? Okay, so we want to do some copper ore to copper. Um, we want to have... Um, the effects is going to be copper 50, 50 grams. 50 kilograms, sorry. And we need how much for the battery? 200? Okay. Somebody can come down here and work. There's some oxygen. It's breathable. DJ Cookie's almost skill scrubbed. Caddy Boy has decided to come down here and do this. It's nice. Okay, DJ Cookie's all done. So DJ Cookie, with your two skill points, we're going to go improved uh, farming and then critter ranching. And we're going to give you a nice hat for critter ranching. There you go. Well done, DJ Cookie. Let's get wrangling, baby. Let's wrangle him up. It's bedtime. <laughs> well done, DJ Cookie. What a day. What a day. What a what a what a great day. DJ uh, Ager is able to now do a plus two excavation, diamond, and obsidian mining. This is um, super duper hard digging. Super duper hard digging. Let's do it. Uh, Kenny um, is able to go into improved farming too. 
can identify mutant seeds at the botanical analyzer, which gives him more agriculture. Sure. Um, same with you. Let's give you um, improved farming two hat. And you as well. Panda bear. We want you to be able to do this science. Nice. Um, and we could also get you into hey, astronomy, Shipsy. too. Laura right? Lana wants to be a dupe. Is this a sufficient tribute for her to become one? Hey, Pirate Badgers, uh, thanks for the 25. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we, as soon as we make another dupe, we'll get uh, Laura Lana in. Th th thanks very much. It was uh, unnecessary. Laura Lana could have just said, and I would have said, yeah, of course. Cookie, yup, defiantly my username, not ATR, all my old username, yep, seems good to me. Electrical engineering. There you go, Rob XD. Look at that. Hey, DJ Cookson. Thanks so much for the 10. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. That's nice. That's nice. It's real tight. Good. What's next? We can start getting into doing the uh, the atomic uh, research. Um, which would be fine. Solid transport and smart storage. We're going to have a mechatronic uh, engineer soon, so we'll be able to do some of this stuff. Oh, yeah, we want this stuff too, right? Yeah. Missing a hat on a dupe? Well, sorry, I mean, it just uh, it happens sometimes. Did we make everything that we needed here? At Sips underscore just wanted no. to say been watching you since early 2010s. You've got me through very tough times, and I just want to let you know I appreciate your content and your humor. Hey, Drew Weezy, thanks so much for the thousand bits. I hope that um, you're not having as many tough times. Thank you so much. Thanks for the kind words. Okay, good. We're now powering um, all this stuff unnecessarily the skill scrubber doesn't need to be powered all the time but actually this rock crusher consumes a lot of power so that's fine we'll keep this battery topped up and then we'll get it onto a smart battery and then we'll be able to do some other stuff we'll start setting up to do some atomic research down here yeah Good. I'm excited. What's the temperature down here? It's like 30 something degrees. Okay, Laura Lana, this might be you. Uh, suit wearing and tidying, uh, medicine, athletics. No. You're doing great, Dad. Super hey, duper Dad, hard digging. Lately, have been under a lot of stress with planning a wedding and buying out first house. Wow. It's all very exciting but scary. Mm -hmm. Just wanted to let you know that your shitty streams help with the stress. Love you. Kiss, kiss. Hey, Gino. Thanks so much for the 10 and good luck. Moving house, buying a house and moving into a house for the first time is very stressful. And also a wedding, planning a wedding at the same time is stressful. But uh, the nice thing is, is that when it's all done, um, it's great. You have a nice house and, uh, and, a, and a beautiful wife. And you think to yourself, by God, how did I get here? Letting the days go by, let the water pull me down. Let me yeah, but it's great. It's, it's good. It's worth it. It's worth the stress. It's like temporary stress for uh, long-term happiness. It's a, it's a no-brainer. Good luck. Thanks for the 10. Keep your pecker up, stay frosty, and go fuck yourself. Thank you very much, Gino Cappuccino. I appreciate it. We're rejecting all of these, by the way. Yeah? DMCA. What do you mean? DMCA. No thanks. No. No thank you. No thank you. I think we have everything we need for a smart battery. We do. We can make a smart battery. We also need the automation, um, which uh, is the automation wire 
costs um, some resources and bridges and switches and all that kind of stuff too. So we're going to have to make a bit more of this. Let's make four more. And then we have some extra on hand. And we have to start planting these reeds. And um, we have some polluted oxygen getting through, but not much. We've got two of these deodorizers working on it here. So it should be fine. I think we, we produce clay. Use sand to filter polluted oxygen from the air, reducing disease spread. And the output is clay, oxygen, heat. Yeah, so we make some clay. Or is there clay going in there? I'm not sure. I can't remember. I can't remember. I'm, I'm stupid. There's so many farts. It's a lot of farts. We're still only producing oxygen via one of these things. That'll have to change pretty soon. We're gonna have to get we're gonna have to get proper oxygen production set up pretty soon. Uh, there's a baby Paku here. Has this guy been groomed? He has been. Okay, one hatch has been captured. Let's capture this one. There's a whole bunch of hatches up here that we can do with wrangling up and storing in there. It doesn't matter if they're cramped, right? We'll just chuck them all in there and feed them sandstone and and uh, they can produce coal. Let's get our coal stored down here too, right next to this. Let's get an airflow tile. Not sure my hydroponic plants pipes set up. They're not, no, I haven't done it yet. I need a, to get a pump and stuff, but I wanted to get this, uh, I want to get this power stuff done before I get that pump set up. All right, so this is going to be uh, consumable or coal. Copy settings. Store all of our coal in those hoppers. Um, let's get the smart battery in. Um, and then let's get some automation. Um, and then let's get this connected to here too. So the high threshold is 100 and the low threshold is what, like 60? So when it's powered up to 100, the coal generator should disable. Yeah, that's good. That's real good. But then when it drops below 60, um, the uh, coal generator will uh, will fire up again, right? Is that right? So there, it's like a like a 40 in between. Oh, I've got myself a 40. I've got myself a shorty. Uh, we need a liquid bridge. And a liquid pipe It's going to go up here and connect up with this. And then we can start growing all this stuff as well. Good. Man, this place is working... This place is working well. I mean, we're just at the start here, but you know, like once we get more into it or whatever, uh, we need a way to generate um, radiation now if we want to do any of this atomic research. And I think Weezwarts is a good is a good shout. 
Oh, look at this. We've got a um, natural gas geyser over here, too. That'll be good. That'll be some... We could do some... Uh, we can get some power from that, right? Be good for power. Not so much the uh, steam in here. Cool steam vent. The steam is not hot enough. It'll uh, it'll condense very quickly. Hey, Fishboy, thanks for the five. If you could work any job for a day, it doesn't matter if you're good or bad at it. What job would you pick? Um, probably like... Uh, uh, probably like uh, you know launching uh, spaceships at SpaceX or something like ex like really exciting really different to what I do now yeah no not air traffic controller I, I wouldn't want to do that I think it's too stressful I'd be too stressed out funnily enough launching a, a rocket not as stressed out <laughs> Many, many people would die. No, well, that thing is, there's not that many people in rocket ships, so... Not, not that many people would die. I'm sure I could get it, like... Into space. I don't know if the people that were on it would be alive by the time it got to space, but I'm sure, like... I mean, I'm just the guy who says, 3, 2, 1, let's go, you know? Like, I'm not, I'm not in charge of, like, anything else other than just saying, 3, 2, 1, let's go. I played enough Kerbal Space Program to be good at it. Exactly. That's exactly it. What about hot dog water? What about it? What about it? Alright. Um, so this... Um, this can be reconfigured a little bit. In fact... Let's... Um, let's get this all onto here. And then... So we can cut this off. Okay, so we're gonna do this. It's going to combine, and then probably it might short out. It might not, actually. Uh, and then what we're going to do is we're just going to sever this line here. So once it's hooked up, which it is now, we just sever this line here. And then we'll have two separate things, right? That's the way to do it. Uh, and then we'll have to um, we'll have to get the big boys and stuff. We well, you know how to do all that, but it's just a case of getting it. What's all this? This is all oxygen in here. Sand, igneous rock, sandstone, sulfur. There's a bunch of sulfur down here. Some copper. There's a lot of algae. We have tons of algae right now, though. More algae than I know what to even do with. Um... What else? Oh, yeah, we, we're going to need some refrigerators for food. We're going to need to wrangle up some more of these hatches. See if they lay some eggs. We want to get... We want to get stone hatches, right? But they should be producing some coal for us. We have quite a bit of coal. It's nice. Um, I guess what we're going to want to do now that we actually have the the coal generator up and running and on a smart battery, which is very efficient on our use of coal, um, and our power output will be better, is we can start um, sucking up some of this chlorine and storing it in tanks, and then we can just deploy the chlorine uh, where we need it. Like, mostly when we're trying to get rid of some of these fucking shitty biomes, right? Start cutting into them. Natural gas, we can uh, we can block off and uh, get some um, get some power generated like that as well. That can power up some uh, some of the the hungrier systems. Deploy the chlorine. Yeah, I think that'll be fine, right? We'll just get rid of all the gross like slime lung and shit. Let's break into here. Before we do that, though, we'll get some scrubbers, because there's a whole bunch of polluted oxygen here. We have another dupe. What do we need now? Machinery and agriculture, strength machinery, strength cuisine, tidying, cooking, supplying, operating, operating, farming. We don't need these guys. 
These are not people that we need. The research must continue as well. Um, fossil fuels, now that we have natural gas and plastic manufacturing and shit, I guess. Get it all researched. What do we do with these dudes? These Sweetles. We need to give them some sulfur. They just want sulfur. What uh, what conditions do they need to live in? They're overcrowded, glum, and cramped. Um, it doesn't say. I think they just can survive in anything. They don't need any special biome or whatever. We can wrangle them. And we'll get some sucrose. Su solid sucrose. Is what I'm guessing comes out of them. It's a raw form of sugar. It can be used directly for cooking or find and eaten with meals to increase duplicate morale. Sure. We can make a sugar farm, I guess. Put them inside the piss pit. That's mean. That's mean. We don't need to put them in there. DJ Egger just doing some, like, serious mining over here. Hey, look, there's some carpeted tile here. There's some bliss burst. There's a whole bunch of sulfur over here. What else is sulfur used for? Do we need it for do we need it for anything important or not really? Doo -doo -doo. Oh, do you know what? Actually, that's fine. We're going to do this so that we can build this, but then th these walls will have to go, right, to line up with this. I just put these walls here because of all this polluted oxygen. I just want to try to get the polluted oxygen down through here so I can cleanse it. That's it. Okay, so all of these Sweetles, let's put them into their own farm here and see if we can start feeding them stuff. Um, we're going to need a critter drop-off, another critter feeder... And then we need another station here, a grooming station for the Sweetles. If you put a thin layer of clean water on top of the dirty water, the dirty PP pee -pee water doesn't release polluted gas. It's very useful. Um, how much is it um, releasing right now? Quite a bit. I don't mind a little bit. It says that it's emitting polluted oxygen zero kilograms per second, which is a, probably a lie, right? It's probably still going for it. Look, we got our, li our little Paku friend in here, too. We could get a, a Paku feeder. We can feed him and make more Paku. These guys will create polluted dirt for us. Too much? What about we get one of those little puffer guys as well? He can make some slime for us. That would be nice. I haven't seen one anywhere, though. We might need to wait for a care package or something. All right, so in here, we're going to say, what were they called again? Sweetle. Sweetle larva as well. And this is going to be Sweetle and Sweetle larva. So sulfur and sulfur. Okay. Let's wrangle these boys up. Wrangle. Wrangle. Let's wrangle him. Wrangle him as well. And then we want to get some sulfur. Actually, there is some right here. Oh my god, the noise they make when they're being wrangled is awful. A horrendous noise. Okay, let's dig into here. Start digging out all this. Okay, here are the Sweetles in their new home. We're going to need another rancher, I think, eventually. Um, what's happening here with this? Hello, pump? The pipe is blocked. Oh, whoops. This liquid bridge is the wrong way around, isn't it? We 
We want it like that. Okay, good. And then we can start growing some of that stuff. Um, this water needs to go into here, so we're going to have to facilitate that. Um, we're going to want to put airflow tiles here and here. Um, and we're also going to want to put some airflow tiles <clears throat> like here. And then uh, probably here. Cut this all off. They can get to it from elsewhere and then we'll open this up and let it drain into here yeah look at the almanac entry for sweetos they have a special function what is it more information sweetle Hatch from Sweetle eggs. Hatch from Grub Grub eggs. They eat sulfur and sucrose and excrete mud. These guys do. These guys just excre excrete sucrose. I don't. There's. I don't see anything else. Hatchling eggs? Hatchling eggs, we can just crack them and cook them up, right? We don't need hatchling eggs. We want the stone hatchlings, that's the one. They shit sugar, yeah. Oh, they buff your plants if you put them in the farms. All right, so on the ground here, we would want to maybe grow some, um, some, some plants. And then collect the the sugar oh look at all the um i think we have a little bit here what's this sand critter feeder what is this no it's not i don't know what this little thing is here so so sucralose is an ingredient or we can refine it into something else All right, look at these thimble reeds. Here we go. We're starting to use some of this poop water. Get rid of all this gross poop water. There's going to be more poop water where that came from. There's plenty of it to store, do stuff with. All of these little buildings are all like little... You can teleport to the other maps, but I think you can't come back. Once a dupe gets teleported over there, they're stuck. I, I don't know if you can send them back or not. I haven't really... Um, I haven't ventured that far out, honestly. Okay, let's open this up and get this water drained in here. Like so. You can come back in a different machine, but there's a, a cooldown, right, okay. I think, um, yeah, we haven't, there's three other um, asteroids close to us, but we haven't discovered any of them yet. I think you can discover them by hitting these buildings, points of interest or whatever. Or I think you can use the telescope and find them as well, if you have a uh, orbital science person. I think that's how it works. I think. I don't know. Do you know how to make Aquatuner cooling loops? Not really well, no. No, I, the one thing I've never really done with this game is uh, had like a... Um, had like a, a map open on the side where I can just build everything and try things out. Like usually it's, it's a lot... With me, it's just a lot of trial and error. Which is fine. I mean, I, I like playing it that way, but... Okay, let's get that done too. So we're... Hopefully not going to flood the whole base here. 
It looks like there's enough space for all this water to fit, but you never know. No need to min-max everything? No, I don't feel the need to min-max everything. For sure. Okay, that's good, actually. We'll let this drain out, level off, and then see where we're at. Oh, no, it's coming back over. That's fine. Okay, our Sweetles uh, have um, a lot of food here. This is good. We've got sand stored next to all of these. This is good. We've got all of our poop and peep water in here. Um, we're going to try to get some chlorine stored up so that we can deal with, like, gross um, germs and shit when we start excavating out some of these biomes. Maybe we do this one first, since it's lower down. We can just start dumping chlorine down here. We might have another dupe here. Uh, a balm lily seed or a shine nymph. Uh, we have cooking plus 14 cuisine, construction, and science. Okay, we don't need these guys. We want to keep res going with the research as well. Food repro repurposing is not something that we really need. Let's get uh, this stuff. And then we'll just work our way down and get all of these ones that we can without needing the nuclear stuff. Good. Please name it after Lorulana. Yeah, I will. As soon as we get another one in, I will. But we don't need to get any in right now, so we shouldn't really bother getting any in. Um, I think the rest of this water will fit no problem, actually. So let's start um, opening it up. To fit in there now that it's leveled off. It's a this is an attractive water tank, isn't it? It's, it's good. It's a real good one. The rest of it we can just sweep up, and then that opens up more of the map for us to expand into, build some more shit if we need to. I don't think we really need to build any any shit right now as such, which is pretty good. Um, we're gonna want to go in and grab some of this chlorine, or at least open it up so that the chlorine is a bit more free to do its thing. And then maybe we can just get like a, an air pump and a filter. So we pump the chlorine into big uh, storage tanks. And then anything else that we get, we can just pump it back into the base. And then scrub it if it's polluted oxygen. And just add it to the rest of the base if it's regular oxygen. We're actually not too bad for oxygen right now. But as we open things up here, um, we'll need to uh, start creating oxygen. We'll have to make like a... Um, We'll have to make like a factory for it, right? An oxygen factory. Because oxygen is not included. Uh, maybe we could put it in this area that I'm digging out here. It's a big area. Get some, um, get some um, insulation and stuff around it. What's the, um, what's, what's the, what's the go-to, um, um, spawn now like uh, is 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 there is there like a good one or should we just make our own or what like I don't really care we just want something that's gonna produce oxygen and then maybe with some of the uh, maybe with some of the hydrogen we can um, use it for power some of it for power and then some of it we could pump into a room and we could uh, maybe ranch some uh, drecklets see if we can get the the guys that have the plastic maybe get some natural plastic The full Rodriguez? I've heard of this, but I don't know what the design is. This guy is um, stuck. This guy is very stuck. Okay, let's give this a higher priority so that this guy is not stuck. I really do open wikis. Sometimes. Depending. Yeah. Within reason, I'd say. I'll open a wiki. There's a lot of carbon dioxide down here. Equally, there's a lot of chlorine falling to the bottom here. 
Maybe when we do open up chlorine, we'll let the chlorine travel down to the bottom and uh, we can scoop it all up down here. That might be better, right? Get like a get like a nice like uh, like gas holder. Can you link the full Rodriguez? I think so, yeah. Or just maybe whisper it to one of the mods and uh, get the mod to add it to like the uh, a thing, a command. Just make a big storage room full of gas tanks. No, well, I want to. I want a place that to pump it out easier. You know what I mean? Like chlorine and carbon dioxide will just fall down to the to the bottom here. And then uh, it's just easier to filter out the gases with the pumps, right? You just put the pumps, like, on the ground level. And they'll just scoop up all the carbon dioxide. We can spit it out towards the skimmer. And then all of the uh, chlorine will uh, will filter that into, into tanks. A full Rodriguez. What's with the name? Why, why a full Rodriguez? I mean, it's a cool name, don't get me wrong. Because it's twice the half Rodriguez. All right. Nice. Okay, let's open these up again. They don't need to be there. What's a Rodriguez? I don't know. I don't know. You're asking the wrong guy. I just don't know. There's a whole bunch of computer desks and stuff there. Um, there's also these lockers here. We can always check to see what's in these. But we'll open up uh, this polluted oxygen. Is this full of germs as well? No, it's just polluted oxygen. That's okay. Um, if it's just polluted oxygen, let's get a, uh, a tile here. Oh, actually, let's, uh, let's build into this one. So we'll get airflow here and here, airflow here and here. Tile all the way over here. Uh, let's let them sweep this stuff up first, and then... So we don't have water going everywhere. And then we'll dig this out too. You have to invent a system so we can name it after you. Okay, I'll invent my own. I'll just design my own. <clears throat> the full rip. The light rip. The half and half. Why does this thing have no power? Oh, is it because it's just unassigned? So it's not it's not using up any power. It's it's not assigned. How have you managed this? How? Man, the dupes are really dumb, eh? <clears throat> you missed Diaper Dan? Me too. Me too. Okay, so we have plenty of carbon dioxide down here and chlorine. Uh, we could probably move the carbon skinner down to the bottom here so that this chlorine has a chance to fall down and then we'll scoop it all up at the bottom. This is no longer the lowest point, so we want to move this it looks like it's still actually doing stuff though let's deconstruct it here we have some colored colony achievements as well i've been neglecting these red light green light automate a building done look at all this water we have Look at how do you do the 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 really far zoom out? What's the button? 
how do I zoom out even further? There's a button, right? Try V. Alt F4. Alt S. Alt S. There, that's what that's what we've made so far. We've dug out all this stuff and we made this. Pardon me. Pardon me. Okay. Um, so we want a um, carbon skimmer at the bottom here. And we want this plumbing to go into here. Uh, and then let's get a bridge like that. And then let's get this bad boy powered up too. Okay, and uh, we can get rid of these wires here. Perfect. Um, let's also get some uh, tiles in here so that we don't have stuff getting trapped here and then it'll make its way all the way down. <coughs> Pardon me. Uh, similarly here. Let's do this and let's also do this so that we get all of it. Yeah? 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 Hello! Um, tidying, operating rocketry, operating doctoring, supplying, ranching, operating and tidying. Um, decreased machinery, which is kind of weird. Machinery minus three, but then machinery plus one, and then operating as well. But actually, you just want the ranching. Increased creativity, decreased decor morale bonus. Okay, fine. We're going to get you in. This is going to be Lor Lorulana. Lor Lorulana, I think I spelled it right. Lorulana, you're in. You're going to do, you're going to do some ranching. You're in. Not not actual urine, but like you know, you 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 are in, Lorelana. There you go. Thanks. No problem. Got you in. I told you we would. Um, what were we working on getting next? Smelting, refined renovations with the pole. That'd be good. What's this? A payload opener. That's cool. We've done so much science. All right. Let's start scrubbing more carbon dioxide down here. This will be good. And um, let's mop up some of this water that's managed to fall down here. And um, let's also get um, some deodorizers here and here to plug these bad boys in. Um, oh. Yeah, of course, this is why it's not plugged in. Right. That'll be it. That'll be the one. Um, skills? For Lorelana, we want you to go into uh, improved farming with a view of getting into ranching. Uh, you could do some cooking, grilling and cooking. And Rob XD, uh, we want you to get into mechatronics, but you're not quite there yet. Uh, it's because you need uh, improved carrying too. So let's get you in that as well. You could do mechatronics. See, RobXD is actually going to be useful. Uh, Kenny, you can do some um, rocket piloting. You don't need to do any just yet. DJ Cookie, let's get you into ranching too. Nice. Let's give you the ranching too hat as well. Look at this hazmat digging. Corium mining. Okay, we don't have to do that just yet, but we can give you improved strength and plumbing. 
look at that dj agar oh my god okay and caddy boy uh you're our construction dude right we're gonna get you into construction but we're also gonna get you into mining and stuff as well but construction for now improve construction too there you go done can i i love you can i good good we have another achievement here no it lied we don't actually have one and research is underway once again too so we're going to open this up and check these lockers maybe there's some like snazzy suits or something in there lieutenant dan i love you lieutenant dan Okay, another thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna get airflow, 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 airflow. And we're gonna have some more deodorizers set up here and here. Which means that we're gonna have to power these as well. Potential power consume is 1.34 kilowatts. Is that is that so? 1.34? Oh, because of all the pumps and stuff? It could happen. It could happen. We'd have to be careful. We might have to split it. We might need to get another smart battery and get uh, like another... Oh, you know why? Because into this grid, we're only... We're only... Oh yeah, it's potential load uses one thousand three hundred forty out of a thousand. It's the maximum of of a thousand, but we're not actually producing a thousand, right? On here, we're only producing. Um, how much does this produce? Oh, it can produce more. Six hundred watts. It can only make 600. So we need two on there to get the full, the full 1,000. Okay, good. Scrubbers online. These scrubbers are all online now too. So let's get airflow here, like so. We want to get all of this carbon dioxide and polluted oxygen out of here and scrubbed. And then the carbon dioxide will skim it. And get to the bottom. Some polluted oxygen might get through here, but only a little bit, right? These things are just going crazy right now. Um, right. Uh, let's, ins let's rummage through here and rummage through here as well. And then we could just start disabling all this. Anything good? A cool vest. And a snazzy suit. Okay, Caddy Boy, I'm giving you the cool vest. Um, and um, DJ Cookie, I'm giving you the snazzy suit. That's my that's my final... Um, we have 88,000 kcals. Some of this stuff is going to be going off. Do we want to... Do we want to uh, cook up our meal lice into pickled and then store the pickled in fridges this is another thing that we're, we're gonna have to do at some point <laughs> wasting a snazzy suit on rob xd exactly so there's not that much carbon dioxide left down here it's a little tiny bit but the air is thinning out down here too, so we're gonna need to think about getting the. What was the thing? What was it? The full Rodriguez, full, full Rodriguez. This spawn is the so-called full Rodriguez. Oh yeah, it's a big one.
Okay, should we start making this thing? They have a blueprint mod that you can download. It's super helpful. There's a website for this. What is it called? What's it called? Yes, do it. Okay, I'm going to do it. You can build a half Rodriguez as well. Why not a full though? Pickled mealwood would have more calories per kg so you can cramp more calories into one fridge. Yeah, that's good. And then we can get the uh, we can get the the electric cooker going as well, right? We're gonna have to separate out some of these um, some of these circuits though, because we're gonna overload, I think. Body temperature here has caused this mealwood to um, halt growth. It's too hot. It's getting too hot. It's getting too hot over here. Who's not picking up their cool vest times one? Nobody? Okay. Oh, caddy boy. Hasn't bothered to come over and pick it up. It's too good for that. Alright, so this carbon dioxide will slowly make its way down to the bottom here and get skimmed. Um, and then we want to start setting up this so-called um, Rodriguez. A full Rodriguez. A Don Rodriguez from the Bronx. Don Rodriguez. It looks like it has six... It'll have seven um, things. It'll have seven uh, air uh, air pumps. Do we really need a full Rodriguez at this point in time? Should we do like a, a half? Guides? Builds. There's another spawn here. This is a... Uh, this is the one that I would normally use. This is like a much smaller one. You need the full one. Go big or go home. The full Rodriguez. You want the full one? Hydrogen vent taming. Liquid hydrogen and oxygen. Small. Decontaminating germy water. Carbon skinner automation. Aqua tuner plus steam turbine cooling loop. This full Rodriguez is enormous. Like, it's a real big one. It's it's too big. It's going to have three pipes coming off. Three separate oxygen pipes. I don't even know what we're going to do with all that. One for the... One for just generally pumping oxygen out into the base. And then, what, two for uh, suits and stuff? Do we want... Do we want some for suits? I don't know if I can really start setting this up now, though. I got to go in, like... 20 minutes you just don't have to use it all at once um won't um oh what so just what you just turn on pumps that, like as you need them you could just turn them on the full will bring you all the way to end game so half is nice and easy one a nice easy one for now yeah i'll go for the half for now that's fine. We can build the full when we need it. This one's a little bit easier to build. It's a, it's a smaller one too. We can build it down here. So we need um, four and four again. So it's just like two of these. How, how wide is that? Two, one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 wide? Sixteen. Um, with doors. And then we're gonna have like like that. And then we want this to go all the way over here like this. 
Um, and then same thing at the top here, like this. Okay, let's try that for now. We have another printing pod. Uh, farming, farming, and building and rocketry. So many farmers. Okay, let's just take this copper. We have too many farmers. Artificial friends? A rover's module and a sweepy's dock? Deploys one rover bot for remote planetoid exploration. Oh, wow. Getting into some advanced shit here. And you're kind of a hard Rod Rodriguez right now. You tweeted the link from Lemon Snow Cone as well? Okay, Laura Len, I'll check. I'll check after. I don't have Twitter open right now. And uh, I'm too lazy to open it up. It's, wasn't it down earlier? Wasn't like the whole internet down at some point? We need rocketry soon enough? Yeah, apparently, yeah. The whole thing was down. Oh, it's back now. Down with the sickness. Get up, get up, get down with the sickness. Okay, so in here we're going to need um, some more insulated tile. So that's like three over. So it's two and then one. And then like that. Same here. On the other side. And then we have... It looks like a base in the middle here. By four. And then we need some manual airlocks. Like that. And then we need some mesh tile. Like that. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. This bomb is good too. Yeah, this one I've built before, I'm pretty sure. It seems to do the job. We're making a uh, self-powered oxygen module. So once this thing gets going, we need to kickstart it. Get all of the stuff out of uh, this chamber here. All these gases out of the chamber. And then once it's nice and emptied out, um, we turn on the electrolyzers and um, the hydrogen and the oxygen that they produce um, will go back into powering this thing up. So it'll, it'll, it'll self-power itself with the hydrogen that's produced. They can't reach this square? Oh yeah. I'll we'll have to um, make it so that they can't. They're having some problems breathing in here right now. This is an infinite power machine. What about kickstarting my heart? There's always a need to kickstart my heart as well. And kickstart my fart too. Very important. Go on. Reach out. Kickstart my fart. Do, 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 do. Whoa. Whoa, yeah, kick, start my fart, don't ever stop now, whoa, yeah, baby. Okay, we're gonna need a tank in here. DJ Cookie, what are you doing? He's, just, he's dying. Do, 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 um right so we need some uh, pumps uh, we need some gold amalgam i think right for these pumps it's gonna get hot in here it's gonna get too hot in here 
ventilation, gas pump. Uh, we have gold amalgam, actually. So we want one at the top here. Um, we want one here, and we want one here. That's a lot of work. That's a lot of work. Where do we want to vent the oxygen to, generally? Just out? You just want to produce a lot of it? There's the Twitch staff in chat. It's Fromey. I clearly have not been around enough for staff to get scared again. No, Fromey. God, it's been a long time. How you doing? Good, I hope. It's been a while. No more full Rodriguez talk. Mm. Try to keep the full Rodriguez talk down to a minimum. Uh, we want... Um, did I not get... Oh, yeah, I got the power transformers. Okay, so we'll make this out of gold as well. So it doesn't overheat. Um, and we want this thing here. Like so. We need a smart battery up here as well. Um, and we also need a um, hydrogen generator here too. Okay. Uh, plus we need um, electrolyzers times two. Somebody's starving. DJ Cookie, why are you starving? Apparently we don't have any cacals left. We should have plenty of cacals. We have a whole ration box here full of cacals. Okay, more research is complete. Um, let's grab this stuff too. Okay, this is coming along. Uh, what else do we need? We need uh, Atmo sensors. We need some Atmo sensors. So we need um, automation for that. No. Ventilation. Oh, maybe I don't have the... Um, maybe I don't have it researched yet. We'll have to get them. Automation wires will be needed as well, right? Has anybody ever redeemed the one billion point reward? I don't think so, no. Not that I not that I've known of. I believe no. Okay, power, we're gonna need uh, two coal generators to kickstart the heart down here. Um, and we're gonna wanna start um, connecting some of this crap up. Yeah. Um, and then we want this to connect down here too. So we're going to have the big wire. And then, so this is what currently um, when it's built, we're not sure. We don't know. We don't know the answer to that. Get this here. Um, actually, let's cancel that because we'll power it all up from up here. Um, and then we'll get the heavy watt wire to run from here into here, right? And then we'll get some heavy watt and a transformer on here too. Power transformer. This one can just be that, it's fine. to do it oh 
we'll connect it up like that to get it kick started. We're gonna need some plumbing. So we're gonna need some water. We're gonna need to have some water coming through here too. Um, let's have it come through here, but not connect it up just yet. Yeah. Oh man, we are building. We're building here now. Oh yeah, we need vents and stuff too. Need some gas pipes. Um, sandstone is fine, I think, for this. So we're gonna go. Is it like all the way up and out? With a bridge. Like that? Wait, what? No, that's not right. It's got to go... Not like that. Um, ventilation... Goes up here. Like so. And then that goes into the tank. Okay, so this goes up and out. This does not. This is going to go uh, over here into... A bridge. What the hell? gas bridge that's gonna go like this and then this goes um, out here why is it going like up like this I don't get it and then we have another bridge here and then this is gonna go like this Is it just to store more hydrogen in, in, in the system or, or whatever? So this is going to go like um, this way, like that, right? It cools the system. Oh, yeah, that's right. The hydrogen takes the heat, right? And then it just gets uh, deleted by the... Um, so does this need to be radiant pipes or just normal? I think it's just normal. Okay, and then I just need a little bit of automation in here too. Oh yeah, but I also need to do the research for... I need the... Um, where is it? Here it is. It's this one. So we need this. Okay. No. Oh, actually, we don't mind if it's powered up straight away, right? Well, yeah, we kind of do. We don't want it to be powered up just yet. Okay. We'll power it on when we're good and ready. I do have to leave early today. I have to leave in like about 10 minutes or so. I got to do some stuff. But I'll be back at 5. I'll be back on at 5 uh, where we will be playing uh, Minecraft PvP in the uh, in the European finals. <laughs> For Minecraft. Minecraft UK. Say hi to KP for me. Okay, I will say hi to KP for you. KP. Who's KP? Beat the tryhard. Say hi to Katy Perry. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. That's who I want to say hi to. Uh, we potentially have another dupe here. Construction? Ranching and operating? Cannot do digging errands. This is just a, a, a builder with plus seven construction. Thimble reeds or joya seeds? Okay, let's get some joya seeds. Oh, King Lang. King, King, 
can't kinlang. I will, Fromey. I, I, I'll say hi. Yeah, it's a weird one, that. It'll be funny, though, I think. Well, I don't know, actually. Maybe you know more about it than I do. Do I need to finish the bottom insulated tiles? Um, it would be good to, yeah. I can get under here. It's fine. There's some oxygen down here. Um... Oh, actually, I don't even know if I can reach those. Okay, so we want to get some automation in here in the form of Atmo sensors. We're going to need um, one here, one here, and one here. And then we have to do some automation wiring as well. We have to automation wire from here to here. Um... Here to here, here to here, and here to here. Okay, let's disable these as well because we're just wasting coal on nothing. Just do it like this for now. Is this guy stranded down here? DJ Agar, what's with the constantly getting stranded and then pissing your pants down here too? You're crazy. He's crazy. He's crazy. He keeps getting trapped down here. Time to fire him, man. I will. I will. Okay, we'll finish this uh, insulated tiling down here. What do these need to be set to? So the Atmo sensor upper for hydrogen is above 750? Above 750? Yeah, and the Atmo sensor for lower oxygen are above 450. Okay, good. Right, so now we want to um, empty out all of this stuff, right? And for that, we're going to need to power this on. We want to empty out into we just want to vent everything out here for now so we're gonna have to power this on We just want to say um, below and below and below. Oh crap, this is going to damage this, isn't it? We're just going to have to repair it. <laughs> We're putting it all through here. Hang on a second. Before we do this more... Um, let's just sever this here. We can just store all this first and then vent it out after, right? Oh my god. Have they all gone to bed? Oh shit. Alright, well, it'll just break. That's annoying. Okay, um, 
oxygen overlay ventilation overlay what's the one for seeing gases again light materials power oxygen This is the one we're looking for. Uh, what are we looking for? We're looking for a vacuum. What does the vacuum look like again? Did they do this? Oh yeah, they have it. good. Look at this guy. Look at him go. DJ Egger is slowly repairing this hydrogen thing. Okay, there's a little bit of chlorine in here still. It's emptying out now. A lot. Okay, we're, we're at full vacuum. So we can go above. Above. And above and then we'll be able to 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 get rid of all this once oh my god please hurry up please hurry up okay we're gonna pipe this out here too so we're going to pipe this out here so that it's just hydrogen we can deconstruct this we need to cool down this this air, or will it, be, will it be too hot? Okay, that's all done. So now we can re-hook this up. Let's get rid of that. Oh yeah, we want to lock the doors, right? Now that it's uh, now that it's nice and toasty in there. We want to lock this one too. There's a whole bunch of crap in here, like dirt and stuff, but I don't know. We'll have to get it after, right? What about the sensors? Have they been switched back? So what... So we just want to pump oxygen directly out here. We're not... Uh, we're not too fussy about where it gets pumped out to either, right? So we should be all good to go. The next thing we need to do is just turn on the water. And then we're good. Once this vent is uh, rebuilt, I don't know why I deconstructed it in the first place. You can make a liquid airlock to keep gases out of there if you want to clean it. That's true. Yeah, I could. Right, I got to go like really soon, chat. Because I have to go and um, I got to do a thing at 2, but I have to go to the bathroom and stuff. So let's just finish this. We'll start it up and then I'll go. But then I'll be back at five for uh, Minecraft, okay? Okay. Off she goes. We're producing oxygen and hydrogen. Nice. There's a little bit of damage occurring here. There's a little bit of oxygen getting in through the top. And I think that's that's normal. I think it's just like until the chamber fills up properly, you get a little tiny bit of damage at the start. Yeah, once the pressure is all sorted out, it'll be fine. See, already, look. It's, it's already regulating itself now. Look.
All right, nice. I don't know if there's... I think we want to have a little reserve of hydrogen built up before we sever the um, all this. All right, but we are now generating oxygen. That's great. And it'll be self-powered pretty soon, too. Husbandry and machinery, construction, agriculture, excavation, and piloting. Building impaired, flatulent, and biohazardous. Oh my god. Okay, let's just grab this muck root for now. I don't really know what we need in terms of dupes. If anything, right now. I think we're, we're probably good just for now. Yeah. Good. Okay, let's deconstruct this and this and this. We don't need them. This thing can self-power itself now. And if we need to give it a little a little jump, we can get the spinning wheel going, right? We don't want to waste all of our precious coal. I think we've got enough. Oh, yeah, we got enough. Look at that. We're storing uh, excess. So this thing is completely self-powering now. That's great. That's real nice. I don't think we really need to get anybody in there either. So let's insulate it to keep the heat from escaping. Make more vents or you'll overflow. Oh, you mean like here? Um, there's still, there's still a room, well, we're going to be excavating out a lot of stuff, so there's always going to be room for gas to move. We're going to be scrubbing more carbon dioxide and stuff too, so we should be, I think we should be fine actually, we just keep excavating out, we should be fine. Okay, let me save this game, um, save as, Burt Reynolds Vacation Station, let's just save. Sure, you want to overwrite Burt Reynolds' vacation station? Yeah. Um, we'll be back. We'll play some more tomorrow. Uh, Wednesday. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Wednesdays. Tomorrow's a weird one too, but um, because I, I won't be here in the afternoon. I got to go at two again tomorrow. But I, it's because I'm recording like a brand deal thing with uh, Lewis and Duncan in the afternoon. Um, it's not. It's for YouTube. Uh, it's not streamed, so I won't be here in the afternoon tomorrow either. Uh, but we'll have some time in the morning to play this, and we'll, we'll carry on then. Uh, listen, I got to go now, but I will be back at 5 o'clock uh, in three hours' time. I'll be back. This streaming, we'll, we'll go live and everything. Um, oh, I just bit my tongue. We're playing um, Minecraft, PvP, Minecraft UK. Uh, this is for the European finals. Remember the one where we were playing against uh, Martin and Penguin and Bree and all those guys? It's that one again. Uh, so we're going to be doing that at 5 o'clock. Uh, but until then, I have a couple of things I need to do, including I, I need to do a gigantic horse piss uh, before I do this uh, this meeting that I have to go to as well. So that's pretty silly. Don't bite your tongue. I know, Dowie. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. But look, it, we've made some great progress. Uh, it's been uh, it's been nice. Uh, but like I said, I got to go. So I'll be back at 5. I'll see you then for some red hot Minecraft PvP action on Twitch Rivals. And um, until then, enjoy the rest of your day, I guess. And I'll see you, um, see you soon. If you're not joining me again at 5, I'll see you tomorrow. We'll play some more Oxygen Not Included tomorrow. Thanks for the subs. Thanks for the resubs. Thanks for all the donations. I appreciate it as usual. Thank you very much. And I'll see you guys in like, uh, in like three hours. Yeah? Okay. LOL, chat.